low energy. What's up, guys, and welcome to another exciting episode of the MyCast Experience. I am your host, Chris King Kriven, aka Mike. With me, we have special guest, Westside Woola, aka Westy, aka That's me. Wiley. Yeah, um, okay, a few things. Is this updated? Yeah. Okay, alright. Yeah, I'll uh, call let me just... Okay, no, we're, we're good, we're good. All right, so some of you may have noticed that we switched over to a new way of chatting up in here. So we're going to be testing this. And I want to specifically say this, okay, just so everybody is on the same page as me. We're going to test this so that, not because I want to prevent more people from getting banned because they're saying the N-word. I don't give two shits about it's that. Funny. If you can't fucking... If you can't do it, if you can't not say offensive shit, I don't give two shits of a bat. You can get banned for all I care. <laughs> you can't Let me say just it. move this. Let me just move this. Oh, yeah, it's like a little bit. Off a little, a little bit. <laughs> but that being said. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, what I made you it done? worse. I made it worse. Hold on. Uh, uh, okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No, they're still. It's all right. Anyway, I think you can. But right there. Oh, I know. <laughs> it's because I accidentally touched it the other day. I was just trying to do something. Um, but you know, maybe this is a better system, and I'm all for trying things. But if new people start coming in and having like zero clue what the fuck's happening, if that happens often, I'm switching us back. I don't even care. But that I being can. said, I have ways around this. If we can get around it and I can keep everybody happy, I am a okay with that. All right, disclaimer done. So hopefully this works. It's a little bit weird for me to be. I don't know what it is about this. That's it's probably because it's all on this side. It is weird. Um, but yeah, hopefully this works. If there's any problems, obviously let us know. But it should be okay, I think. The bot seems to be working. Uh, it is one way though. So if nobody's gonna be able to say things to the people that are in the mixer chat so that's like whatever <laughs> it'll, i'm sure it'll be fine so um yeah that's it and the other exciting piece of news is that we're gonna be going back to a game that honestly i didn't think we we're gonna be playing for why a long do you time. think we would oh yeah that, i mean that's fair that's fair <laughs> we're gonna be playing stay stay dp arcade today which for those of you who may not know because it's been fucking forever <laughs> <laughs> the, it's a visual novel about oh my god some naive white guy who just shows up in uh, North Korea thinking that it's South Korea thinking that his pen pals oh, nice are, I don't what is that what is that it's evil Westy <laughs> yeah I mean I'm all for the you know our own streaming app I'm okay with that I'm just saying that like this is a yeah anyway doesn't matter so we're gonna be playing Stay Safe DPRK. <laughs> And I guess we're finishing it, but I cannot believe we're going to be playing this again for a lot of reasons. One being that we actually beat Super Bunny Man. We beat Super Bunny Man temporarily. That, no. <laughs> I mean, the devs can take their sweet time making the next set of maps. Like, polish it up, my dude. Don't worry about the deadlines. <laughs> don't worry. I just, I don't... <laughs> I think I'm okay with taking a break from that game. Okay, this is really weird that it's... Oh, maybe... Okay, I know. I know what to do. Okay, can you move that over a bit, and then we'll just, uh, this is gonna bother <laughs> It's really bothering you. Which way do you want me to go? Pull towards you. Oh, that's it. Okay. For now. Oh, okay. okay, for now. Let me just test that by turning it a tiny bit. Oh my god. Hello? Okay, there we go. Okay, I mean, you need to sit down now. Just make sure. Just let's see if uh... Okay, well, that's better. That's better. So, also, I have a question for Westy. Mm -hmm. Westy, this weekend will you be playing Resident Evil 2 Remastered? Oh, good. Uh, yes. I will be playing nice. tomorrow. Whoa! I don't, I don't know when yet. Tomorrow? But probably two in the streams? <laughs> yeah. 
So I'm super excited and maybe a little, uh, or sorry, a lot scared, but <laughs> a um, lot scared. I'll be playing it tomorrow. Well, I'm thinking like maybe three to five p.m. is the start time. I haven't decided yet, but maybe whatever. Work, I guess if people are gonna be around later on, let me know. I'll just start it later. But I will be playing the Resident Evil Two remake, and I'm gonna try to go for like four hours. Whoa! I'm gonna try. That's a, that's a hard stream. So maybe I'll just um, take my heart medicine and um, you know maybe have like a ER team on standby. And then we'll play. That's it. What's the over under on pauses? Okay, here's the official stance, all right? On pauses. I am not allowed to pause unless for the following reasons, okay? <laughs> His One, rules. I'm configuring something or I'm like testing a setting and trying to actually tweak something. Two, I need to get up and like go get a drink or get something to eat or, or go to the bathroom, whatever. Uh, three, is if I am legitimately like trying to fix something, which I guess goes under the testing, tweaking stuff, um, or I need to access something. That's it. If I'm, if I pause for longer than like five seconds because I'm too scared, then I want you guys to call me out in the chat. Okay. <laughs> I will. I will. Uh, how about this? Let's give some real stakes. I will donate a dollar to Extra Life for every time I pause longer than five seconds. Whoa. I'm Amazing! I'm committed. Well, thanks for the follow or the host. Um, final <laughs> no, no, don't police it. Just if I break the rule, <laughs> if I break this particular rule, I want someone to keep track, and then I will pay my dues come the end of the year. <laughs> we'll pay my dues. <laughs> okay, I am committed. You guys have to make sure. You get it every time. Someone better have like a fucking stopwatch. <laughs> so like if I pause for longer than five seconds and it's not any one of those reasons, okay? I'll abide. Okay, that's it. We're starting. Wait, I have another announcement. Oh, fuck, this is a announcement. Heavy more speed. announcements. I have more codes to give away. Nice. Which means more cutthroat Jackbox competition tonight. Yeah, nice. Generously, generously donated to us by tr 3 z 4 mail Ooh, thank you, tr 3 z Thank you for the host, Lone Ranger, and thank you for the host, Sporgan Fluke. Mm. Much appreciated. I guess I'll mention it since we're just doing this like stream of announcements. Nice. So, assuming, and yeah, this is a big assumption, assuming that I beat RE2 Remake, um, I will be doing a playthrough of the OG version as well. And that should hopefully be a little bit less scary for me. Um, yeah. That's it. Hi, I want to die. Let's jump into the game. That is me every day. <laughs> hey! Do we have scenes? <laughs> <We can. laughs> it's very musical there. <laughs> I've never heard a more depressing definition of what sing song looks like. It's like I'm like in my own musical. <laughs> the Mike Cast musical. <laughs> Can we clip that? I just, <laughs> I just, I need to watch that again. Just. <laughs> All right, we're starting. Uh, Wait, do we have scenes though? Oh, you did ask that. Yeah. I, I don't know. <laughs> oh shit. I don't remember where we left off is the problem. A Soquid? So Soquid? Is Soquid even here? Soquid, does anybody remember? Does anybody remember I don't what think happened Soquid's in this game? Soquid's even here. Um Soquid? Where's Soquid in this? Here. You received an invite. But it's an invalid invite. Ooh, get fucked. Oh, I'm already in it, so. Oh. No. Um I don't know what I'm doing. We're just, we're just, we're just gonna pause for a second. I have... Okay, yeah, this is ridiculous. I looked over and he had this and I... <laughs> it's just... It's, it's a box. A large box filled with, um, like cherry tomatoes. They're good. They're actually grape tomatoes. Oh, sorry, grape tomatoes. It's only 907 grams of tomatoes, so... Because I don't have... I didn't have enough time to get food. a kilogram of tomatoes. Wow. You're not wrong. It's so much. So that's all I'm eating because I don't have anything else right now to eat. Okay. I cannot, I personally cannot believe 
That Soquid is not here. You know what? No, fuck Soquid. We just gotta do it? Yeah. We might be soon be streaming on our streaming app because we might just be going down tonight. <laughs> Find out. Don't worry, we're we're gonna what's what's our backup after this? I wanna do YouTube gaming. YouTube gaming? Here's the thing, I didn't want to go to YouTube gaming originally because the chat sucked. But <laughs> now they have our own chat. I remember interface. I remember thinking not wanting to go to YouTube gaming because the YouTube rules are even worse than the ones on Twitch. Are they really? I don't know about the I streaming know the... side. I know mm. like like the actual videos and shit has like the worst possible system. Where it's just like you're default guilty, right? Until proven innocent. <laughs> That's how the uh, law is in Japan. I recently learned. Daily motion. <laughs> Man, I haven't heard that in a while. Okay. We're starting. Um, I guess I hit continue. September. September. <laughs> last year. <laughs> That's nice. what. Uh, October, November, December. I don't even know. Almost six months. I don't even know what the voices are. Me neither. Anymore. Does like, anybody I've, remember before we start this? I've I'm just completely gonna forgotten. I have no idea. Is that the load button? Oh, it's instant load. <laughs> instant load. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot these games were lightweight. Um. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, the, uh, the, the less... I'm actually really concerned that we don't have scenes. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm pretty concerned. What do we do? What do we do? We we'll just have to play another game until somebody gets back. Honestly, like what do we? Soka, do? where is he? I should have. Where I is he? I should have contacted him before this. Could but somebody text him and ask him why he's not here? Him. And if he's not here, why does he deserve green? You know, a, cu a Kush crew must have one hundred percent attendance. Right? I mean, you know, you or ninety eight percent. When What's we a, need him, five nines. Five when when we need him, he's not here. Thank you, thank you for messaging him. They were pretty obvious. He's yeah. Probably... Where is he? Okay, hopefully soon. Oh yeah, we can ask Trez now. That's true, Trez. Yeah. Thank God. Ah, uh, he passed out during the day's parking lot again. That is a really classic setting. You know the problem with drunk people is that like they'll go into the Denny's, and I feel this on a very deep level because I used to work <laughs> at a restaurant. That they'll come into the Denny's like at like a, a really stupid time, and then because they're drunk, they feel like they need to eat something. Yeah, the problem with being eat. drunk <laughs> is that you don't really have an actual like appetite, so you just like order a shitload of food because you gotta like stuff yourself with food. But then you're like, oh, I'm not really that hungry, and you want to throw up. So then they just eat like two bites, and then you gotta throw out the rest, like the entire. I thing. mean, to be fair though, you still get paid though, right? Like, who cares then? I don't know. I just I can't. <laughs> I came from the you know, it. I came from the boat. You came okay? from Asia. Yeah. I and I can't what you're see. Saying, I can't. I yeah. cannot watch somebody else waste food. It's just too hard. I understand. Hard for me. Man. I I agree with you actually. Should we just start this time? Okay. Why are you like sick, baby? Are you okay? Don't die. I was sick yesterday, but I'm oh, better today. It's too bad. Yeah, I, I, I specifically invited. Oh my god! Him. Do you want to tell? <laughs> oh, I like. No. I call him up yesterday at work and of course he a answers it in his classic annoying fashion my crew here <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's a perfectly fine like way to answer the it's very professional. it sounds like it sounds like your voice acting it's very professional <laughs> it is it is not indicative of like what you sound like at all and then like i invited him to this like party game night thing that we were having in the office because because like we invited the intern and she was going to show up and i was like yeah. I'll call Micah. Like, this is the whole point of having this game night is to have the two of them together. And he's like, I'm sick. I can't go. Yeah. I can't go anywhere. <laughs> I was like, ooh, big oof. Yeah, she was it for the whole thing. Sad, Play, we played Jackbox. Dude, you uh, played, dude, like... Jackbox. <laughs> nice. We played Jackbox, and, and, and of course, everybody there, uh, other than a few of us, are, like, really... What's the word? They're in a different generation. Let's just put it that way. So everybody's having trouble... One, reading the code on the screen. 
and then two, going to Jackbox for that TV and then actually putting in the code. Putting in the code. They're like, from how does, screen. How how does, does this work? work? How do they connect? I'm I don't like, understand. go to Jackbox.tv on your phone and type in the code, which I, I thought was like, you know, like really easy. enough instructions to get it started. <laughs> but people were just like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm like, put it, put it in the, <laughs> the browser. He's like, oh, oh, I'm having problems. Oh, the, the Wi Fi is not I'm like, what is happening? <laughs> But oh it was overall, it was good, except Mike wasn't there, so. I wasn't there. I was too bad. Yesterday. All right. I'm a little worried that I'm going to finish eating Why did this. you invite, like, a former intern? Like, <laughs> this, this seems weird. Because I was going to invite you. That's literally oh. just told you oh. the reason. <laughs> was that literally the only reason? Well, no. It was like it was, it was just like, well, we can invite anybody. Yeah. I was like, why don't we just invite Steph? I mean, I guess, yeah. Why, why don't we just invite her, and then well, I can invite Mike. <laughs> She was there, which was like, Where's kind of funny, because everybody else was like, more relevant to the company. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> her of all places, like, yeah. <laughs> it makes, it's just it's weird to me. <laughs> She's like, like, uh, we're meeting a bunch of, like, uh, people, and we, we have a new person in the company now, too, so, like, that was, like, it kind of worked Whoa. out. Who? Um, uh, her name's, actually, her name's pretty cool, The Lynn. Anyway, it doesn't matter what she is or who okay. she is. She's a new person, and it just happened that we had, like, a game night. And then, like, as everybody was introducing to, uh, uh, introducing themselves to each other, <laughs> uh, her husband, like, intro- uh, was, like, trying to get everybody's names. Like, oh, I'm really bad with names. And, and then, uh, she introduced herself. She's like, you probably don't remember my name, because, like, you probably won't see me. <laughs> like, I'm not, ah, I'm not, I'm not funny. really good. I was like, yeah, <laughs> she's literally, like, a former intern. <laughs> Dude, that's me. That's me at Achievement Hunter. Yeah. <laughs> Only the OGs remember. Yeah. I was like, uh, that that's true. I don't think she has Overwatch. I should have asked. Honestly, I should have had a checklist. But, yeah, honestly. But I didn't think I was like... Do I you have fo- VR? Do you have Overwatch? Do you have a boyfriend? I it's should make a great. form for you. Because then you could just make it a contract right there. That's true, yeah. I'll make a form next time I see her. But anyway, I don't think she has Overwatch. And, Sad. Um, no, what's sad is that you weren't there. Also sad. <laughs> but that's okay. Okay, I'm seriously concerned. But she gonna... didn't bring her boyfriend then. No. She did. Which is why it was even sadder that you weren't yeah, there. Yeah, that is sad. You could have made a move, man. And I, I had the perfect plan. I was like, okay. <laughs> I'm going to talk to Chris in this table. And I can keep him occupied the whole night. Because he's going to talk video games. And then yeah. like... Uh, and then Michael can just talk to all talk the other people because he just loves talking yeah, to people. Yeah, he's very extroverted. And there's like a huge group of people on like that side of the room. And then, yeah. It's too bad. Why? The chat thing is broken. Yeah, he's a boomer. Oof. Um, what does that mean? Uh, like on Mixer? Mean? Can somebody please... Is oh. It, oh, it's because it's only one way. If it's two way, that would be sick. Hello? Just refresh. Just do a hard reboot. Because you're like the only one that's having issues. <laughs> or you can use that direct link. Thank you, Lone Ranger 25. Okay, let's actually play the game. Okay? No, I'm gonna finish these freaking tomatoes before <laughs> we get a start. Throw up. <laughs> they should be all red. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's uh, let let's act, let's actually play the game now, okay? All right, I'm just gonna read this. <coughs> yeah, man, I, I'm. I it's been a long rusty, time. Yeah. It's been a long time. Finishing up, we head back to the car, and go back to the stadium. Yeah, you fixed it good. Yeah, it's because we're going through something else for the embed, so I'm sure it's just like not the best. Uh... Anyway, let's continue. We get there just as the second half starts. Not that it matters. Pyongyang Sports Club is already 6-0 by the time we find our seats again. I don't remember what happened. what's going on. They're going to see this game. I feel like we already saw the game, though. Mm, I don't know. I don't remember. I just, I literally don't remember. Mm. The refs seem to have swallowed their whistles, and the game goes by faster, which bar- with barely any stoppage time. Oh, no, I muted it. Oh, shit. Forgot. We I have to forget. get the whole experience. I always forget to unmute. Good call. In the end, 
Pyongyang SC bit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, I think I remember the beginning of this game. Beat uh, Rim Young Su 9 0. Damn. That's pretty good. As the teams leave the field, the PA guy gets on the horn with information. I don't remember who was the announcer. Okay, does anybody remember anything about I any don't of the voices? I any of the voices at all. I guess I'll just do it. After this tomato. <laughs> Jesus. Alright. Okay. Please stay seated. In 10 minutes, we will have a performance by the number one Korean idol, Park Ri Byul. No idea what that is. Is that a real person? Oh, shit. <laughs> She's um... the racist voice that you use Racist for voice? Oh no, she Asian. doesn't speak any English, that's right. Yugi girl, oh, <laughs> Yugi girl. Oh, really? Are they managed to get on the schedule for this? This is a wonderful... And then the other one was Russian. Yeah, right? okay, okay. We're good. We just import all the past characters into the... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's... Is that... Who's... Who's Cam Blocks? Is that us? I think that's yeah. us. Yeah. Or that's me. Is she that good? I've never heard of her. Oh, her songs are all over to Korea, though we haven't really exported her music to the West yet. Hello? Host? Like, re like a lot of Twitter notifications for some reason. Is that, that's, that's not a good thing, right? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That's, that doesn't seem like a good thing. Knowing you is probably not. I don't understand. Please hold. <laughs> Why are people like responding to this? People are just responding to it? the tweet. Oh shit. Where's Minecraft? Well, Tron, let me link you up. Actually, I don't have a link to it, so. Somebody, somebody. Hey, BB, could you send Tron instructions on how to get to the Minecraft server? Because he asked me on Twitter. I'm just impressed that it's still um, that, that would be super working. swell. Oh, I'm sure it's only a matter of time before she tops your musical video graphic televisions. Hmm. That's, that's interesting. I don't have the heart to tell her how wrong that statement was. Thank you. Beyond the fact that the channel hasn't shown mu music videos since the 1990s. That oh, they're talking about MTV. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was like, I don't get it. Well, I'll look forward to it then. A few minutes later, a makeshift set has been put up and the idol has been brought out. Are we going to see a picture of this person? She's kawaii and decked out in obvious Korean attire. Obvious. Complete with a glorious leader t-shirt. Hell yeah. The music kicks in and it's definitely rough. The sound quality is like something off of an old photograph. Wow. And, and where her cue comes, Park Park Rebeal starts singing. <laughs> Alright, this is you. Go for it. Use your sing song voice. <clears throat> Hydrate. Professionals hydrate before you do this. 99 Soviet balloons floating in the Korean sky. Oh, you said that normally. <laughs> oh, another splendid hit song penned by the glorious leader. <laughs> That's a low blow so quick. Use those now. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> uh, um, this song's basically as old as the guy. I mean, this is a huge hit, you know, in Germany, 1983. What did he write it as a baby in German? Oh god, the singer is even wearing the same jacket from the original <laughs> music video. I don't know why you keep a doubting gloriously the songwriting ability. 
There's no way he'll bow us out for the rest of our idols. Well, she's a pretty <clears throat> singer. And I guess they say copying is the biggest form of flattery. Okay, excellent. He was making a joke? Well, I don't... What was the joke? Minecraft. What was the joke? Playing Minecraft in 2019. He wanted to play my Minecraft! No, that was a joke. The, the joke was... Playing Minecraft in 2019. Where's the... I don't, I don't understand the joke. The joke is playing Minecraft in 2019. Yeah, it's good. Dude, Minecraft just got an update. It's still going strong. Yeah, I'm just I'm just <coughs> I'm just glad that like that Minecraft server is gonna is gonna be okay because Nerd is on the case. <laughs> Sorry, because Nerd is on the street. Uh, although I wouldn't exactly call this rendition <coughs> flattering. If they could update the sound equipment, she might sell that uh, she might sell in the States. I suppose a good will to a but her will be a good for the world. Which date is this? Um I, don't know. I have no idea. Maybe the second one? We're gonna find out, I guess. First or second, most likely. Oh, it might brighten the spirits of others to see the top Korean idol perform. I'm impressed you remember, nerd. Dude, nerd's a real fan. Unlike... Silkwood. Who comes... 38 minutes late. Well, it's actually not 38 minutes late, because we're a little late. Uh, I mean... 38 minutes late. Silkwood? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just nod and smile. I don't think she actually knows that the rest of the world has been leaving... Korea behind. For decades. It appears from the look of their pop idol. Park Rebuild performs three more songs, all covers of popular 80s songs, before finishing her set. <laughs> that's, to, to be fair, that's my fault. I was not. I just had a lot of things going on today. Okay, to her credit, she does have the audience eating from the palm of, uh, of her hand. Although half these people look hungry enough to eat from my hand too. Oh, or just eat my hand if <laughs> Yugi Girl wasn't here. When she bows, I feel like I hear the crowd cheering in earnest for the first time. Time for the main event then. You said this was a friendly, right? Oh yes, April 25 is hosting Ukman FC from Mongolia in a friendship again. <laughs> oh, April 25. April 25. She doesn't know how to use English. I don't know the level of competition, but April 25 is a premier rated team. So, I want to your bet. After my last crushing defeat, maybe we should just enjoy watching this. Oh, fair enough. Looks like the first match of the day was the best of the lot. April 25th is clearly the... Oh, maybe that is a team name. Okay, so maybe you're oh. right. April... April 2-5. April yeah. 2 -5. Is clearly the better team April on the field. April 25. <laughs> <laughs> That's like worse in either scenario. Scoring three goals in the first ten minutes. By halftime, it's 5-1 and April 2-5 has already sent its substitutions to lessen the damage. Guess this match is pretty much settled. Oh, yes, but I'd like to stay and watch it until the end. I don't get to see many football matches with my work in the military. It's really nice to get out, and I've had a nice time with you. Hey, I've had fun too, so sure. Let's stay and finish watching the curb stomp. The second half seems to fly by as April 2-5 decimates the Mongolian visitors. Once the score settles at 8-2 for the final, we walk back to the car. It's starting to get dark, and Yugi Girl yawns as we sit down to go home. Feeling tired? Oh, a little. You wouldn't mind if I took a nap, would you? Not at all. A few minutes later, and she's nodded off. 
a few more minutes later, and she's nuzzled her sleeping head on my shoulder. On one hand, it's nice. On the other, she started drooling. Eh, a guy could have a worse day. <sighs> I feel my eyelids getting heavy as well. Yeah, it's always heavy. Time passes. More time passes. After what feels like no more than a minute. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot less time. Uh, all those seconds. Yeah. I'm snapped seconds. awake as the driver slams on the brakes. I don't remember if there's even a voice for this. There car. was, because he was at the end. Remember? I don't remember what his name was. Chat? His, his voice. Was. Help. What was her father's name? Or voice? It's the same character. Spoilers. Um, what is the, um, <clears throat> what, what is his voice? Oh, you need a lot, a lot of tomatoes. Chat. Chat. What is his voice? Chat? They don't, they don't know. They're not answering it. Maybe they just don't know. It was a deep voice. No, some of these aren't good. These ones. Okay, have the answer? No. Hope I don't. Imagine Get Kim sick. John. Uh, I don't remember. Was it like the doctor's voice? I'm assuming we you voiced it. We have arrived at home. Or we have arrived home, American pig dog. Sure. I nod and gently nudge you, girl. Hey, Sydney Beauty. We're back. <sighs> oh, I thanks for letting me nap. I should be able to get a dinner together. <laughs> Not as creepy. Sounds like a plan. It's been about an hour since we uh, we arrived from our first date expedition to Korea. It's the first one. That was the first one. I think we just switched onto her route. Would make sense. All right. Yugi girl insisted on cooking dinner for everyone. And Jong is in her room writing in her diary. <laughs> Fucking Jong, dude. I'm it's sprawled out on the so floor, itchy. just staring at the ceiling. All right, so quid. I need you to work fast. It's gray. Looks like the roof may have leak up top, or in the top, as I think there's some mold damage. To be honest, I'm a bit bored. I heard that Korea had a thriving nightlife scene. Oh yeah, yeah, this has to be the beginning, because he's still under the wrong impression. Holy fuck, we're so early in. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, it's all in Seoul, in what Jong and Yugi girl called the occupied area of their country. It appears my friends are from the northern half of the peninsula. And Pyongyang is anything but a nightlife paradise. Quite the opposite. That is pretty much what amounts to a curfew law here. Oh, I forgot this game tries to be educational. Yeah. So instead of knocking back a few with the ladies, I'm staring at the ceiling. Sighing, I figure I'll go say hi to Jong and make my way to Yugi Girl's room, where I knock on the door. Hi, John. How goes the writing? Oh, not bad. Oh, not so bad. Just trying to keep track of your trip so I can reflect on it for years to come. Sounds nice. Can I take a look at it? Ah, of course not. A women's journal is sacred. No man should be looking at it. Wait, can we skip certain sections? Probably. I but I don't remember, so we're good. we gotta do it. Damn it, okay, let's continue. <laughs> a journal is a pretty sophisticated name for a diary. What? Westy! Check Discord. Okay. 
I think this is the same one, actually. Yeah, that does look like the same one. Okay, thanks, Soquid. I got it. I suppose so. I guess I just like the world better. Sounds like something an adult would keep. As opposed to a high school girl depicted as being over 18. Oh, well, it's meta. That seems so, like an awfully specific example, but I think I get where you're going. So how can I help you? Well, I'm gonna guess we're not allowed outside at night, being, well, Korea. So I was wondering what you and Yugi girl do for fun during those times. Oh, we read or listen to the radio. Fix each other's hair. Yeah, I guess I could let you mess with my hair, but I doubt you want me anywhere near yours. Or why not? The only hairstyling experience I have is from Paris. So do we! And by that I mean giving Sunday night high and tight cuts before Monday morning formation. So, got anything else in mind? We do have a couple of board games, most are for two players though. But I think we do have one our parents had when we were growing up. We should all play it together. We could probably skip past the game part, because I remember that. Yeah. It's been a while since I played a board game. Guess it could be fun. Oh my god. I'm so excited for whatever next game that... Um... <laughs> Rudy... Rudy, you're in the it, wrong chat. It's a, it's a little bit... Okay, I need people to keep track of how well or how not well it is working so we can figure out Just what Just Rudy's doing. retarded, that's all. R Rudy can't see your messages. Yeah, but he can hear us. Poor Rudy. Rudy, you should be on micast.tv. Why are you not? <laughs> oh, this chat broke for me. Oh, oh, just refresh. Easy. All right, let's continue. Uh, yeah, okay. You don't sound too enthusiastic at the prospect. You'll be fine, unless you're really feeling a buzz cut. Oh, thanks for the host! Das right, bless. Nice. I'd rather not look like a boy. Like anyone could mistake you for a boy, it's not like you're you- It appears Yugi Girl has snuck in on us while we were talking. Oh, you better not finish that bird. Oh, thanks for the host, Uber Scout One. Bless up. Y y European pop stars, huh? Well, why did we name our guy Clan or Cam Blogs? I don't, I don't even know. remember the reference. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> Cam Blogs. Oh, all right. <laughs> what voice is that? Oh, Russian. Okay. Ken Blocks here wanted to play a board game. Oh, thanks for the host, Tarmac Worm. Nice. Bless. I read this. Oh, but we only have one game that's made for more than two players. Oh, yeah, Kanye Roblox. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's the thing. I don't like how it presents it, so maybe we can change it, though. Yeah, you can change the uh, your own theme with the drop down, you guys, if you want. Wait, I can do that too. Yeah. Where? I don't know. It's one of them. Just look around. No, I think it's on the other one. Uh, I don't know. It gave me the option when I was testing it out. Well. So. I don't know. I also do not know. So quid. Thanks for the host. Oh, I know. Looks like it's time to break it out. First time in ages. I'm so excited. Well, the two of you seem pretty high on the idea. Hey, what are we playing? You never said. Oh, we'll tell you later. Let's go eat quickly so we can play. <laughs> Oof, get banned. All right, we can probably skip. Here? Yeah. But watch out, because oh. it might skip. Let me just go to into boobs. It. Or through boobs. Through boobs. Yeah. Skip through the boobs. 
So we're just skipping through the game here. I remember last time it was super long. Honestly, you could tell. Oh, see? Good. Oh, good. Okay, now we get to choose where our ne next date is going. You can tell that we're, we're experienced. <laughs> yeah. Thank God. Okay, where should we go? Let me just save right here. Probably a good idea. Rotate those saves. All right. Okay. Um. Um, where, okay, so where should we go? Click on, let's find out. We have to go with what's her face, so. Um, wait, so quick. Oh, no, 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 I don't need so far this far, right? Is this one? One of these. Well, let's click on it and see. Oh, shit, are we doing, oh. Oh, no, with, oh, yeah. It tells you. Girl. Okay, so where did we not go last game? Oh, it, it crosses it up. Oh, we went with all the other ones, right? We did this one, this one. So let's go to Wonsan. <laughs> we say that so loud. So good, we're going to Wonsan. <laughs> oh, look, you're in, Rooney. Bless. Where? Oh, nice. Looking over the map, a coastal area on the east side of the peninsula has been circled in red ink. Also, in the code, it looks like someone added forward slash forward slash bikini sprites what? here. What? <laughs> Just a comment. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Who am I to argue with the unseen hand of fate beckoning me along? It looks like this may be a bit of a haul, but once it looks like it'd be a cool place to go. There's usually lots to do at the beach, right? Oh, I swear, if I ever find out who wrote that comment about the bikini in the car, he's going to be in the gulag for a month. Can't, couldn't tell I was back because the chat froze as I sent the message. Oof. Well, I'm not taking you there. What? Just forget it and pick somewhere else. Oh. Excuse me? This is like when you ask your phone to do something. Yeah, what just... the fuck? She doesn't tell me no! <laughs> Actually... What was it? What were you trying to do? I was like trying to alarm? set my alarm, but like more than 24 hours ahead. And it was like, actually... You can only set it in the 24 <laughs> Like, in a hour. fucking sassy-ass tone. <laughs> yeah! That's bullshit, dude. That's so fucking funny. Um... Here was something to I've get to never had a piece of technology fucking talk back to me in that, <laughs> like in that, that way. way. <laughs> Actually, like, <laughs> bitch, what'd you say? <laughs> fucking put you in the fucking toilet. I was hoping to get. If I ban someone on here, you're banned from Discord, so don't fucking piss me off. Hey. These this these uh. Songs are really. I'm in a very musical mood tonight. It's <laughs> a really weird disconnect <laughs> between message and uh, <laughs> melody. <laughs> Here I was hoping to get the split watermelons while John had me help her with the sunscreen. What the split watermelon? Like, what does that mean? Like, you split one open. You split one open. Like, you <laughs> split one open. It's pretty descriptive. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get it. I was just trying to think, but then I was like, oh, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Think you could take me then, John? Oh, of course. Oh, she's gonna ultimately it end up taking it. It would be my pleasure. Yeah, you're right. Well, then it's settled. I'll go grab something to wear on the beach, and we'll get the driver over. Oh, no, you don't. Nothing is settled here, me now. You get your scrawny butt back here. And you, a sister, don't you think you're. About oh. trying to edge in on my day. <laughs> You're such a good excuse to just say, like, read <laughs> in the worst possible way. Uh, you, you want to go with me alone, right? Can of blocks. Can of blocks? Fucking funny, dude. <laughs> Oh shit. 
Oh, nerve sister. It's not my fault Ken Blocks wants to... Hey, don't place the blame on me. You're the one who flipped out when I suggested going to Wonsan. Oh, Wonsan. Wonsan! Yugi girl. This is like hitbox for the messaging system. <laughs> Damn. Oh, you're goosing the question. Goosing the question? <laughs> like... That's it. We're going. Get your your bathing suit and meet me at the car. But oh, really? But you just said you wouldn't go there. I uh, changed my mind. As the Americans say, not up or shut up, right? Okay, I know for a fact I didn't teach her that. Yugi girl starts to head back to her room when John calls out. Don't forget your bikini. <laughs> <laughs> That's why she's calling out all. <laughs> oh, I, I'm not wearing one. He can swim if he wants to. I'll be on the beach. But it really won't be that fun of a date if I'm the only one swimming. Go ahead, just wear some shorts or a one piece if you're nervous. You should still swim though. They don't do. The code clearly calls for bikini sprites. Crawley Slater has written this into the code himself, so she must wear a bikini. F fine. Can't be helped if Glorious Leader has instructed me to wear one. Good, you need some sun and Oh, that's the wrong voice. Good, you need some sun anyway, sister. Well, I'm gonna go grab my stuff so we can head out. I'll pack some snacks for the ride. Yugi girl needs to get ready too. I think the whole problem with this system is that you have to go through somebody else. So, and, you know, webhooks sometimes are not the most reliable thing in the world. It might take her a few minutes to dig out her bikini from the mess she calls her room. John laughs as she leaves the room. Hey. I pick up- Oh, that's the wrong voice. Oh, hey, I pick up all the things I want a month, whether I need to or not. Man, we're very rusty. How in the world does your room get so messy when this country barely allows any consumer goods over the border? All Koreans have access to bountiful supplies of modern- Oh. You and I both know that's not true. What happened to everyone is equal? Oh, everyone here is equal. Some are just more equal than others. Okay, I've had no tomatoes. Anyway, it's not, it's a fairly lengthy drive to one son! So we have to hurry. Don't forget your bikini! She's probably steering over that one. She's so kawaii when she's annoyed. I guess I'd be uh, best go get my swimming trunks and get moving. I really hate the fact that my new phone was confiscated. There's no way I'll be able to get anything better than some 1970s KGB spy photo level pictures with this dinosaur <laughs> phone. That's funny. I'm still surprised it even takes color photos. Well, nothing I can do now. Off I go. Oh, why must you take so long getting ready? I was gone all of five minutes. How's that taking a long time? Do you know what could happen in those extra two minutes you took staring at yourself in the mirror? I'm certain a lot of things could happen, but I'm not sure why that matters. It matters because we could have already been in the car and got two minutes ago. True, but we could. We also could have been in the car these past two minutes. You took lecturing me on supposedly taking too long to get ready. That's your annoying attention to facts again. Let's just get going already, Baka. Before I can reply, Yugi Girl has already grabbed my hand and is dragging me out the front door. 
And just like that, we're already in the car and on the road. I can't tell if you drag me by the hand because you love me or hate me. Oh, please. I heard your heart beat faster the instant I grabbed it. So quit complaining like you don't enjoy it. Who said I was complaining? Yugi girl gets close up to my face while she frowns. You sure sounded like you were complaining with that nonsense question. Oh, fuck. Suddenly, the car strikes a puddle and Yugi girl falls into me. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, your elbow was in the dangerous zone. Oh, <laughs> that know. would have been <laughs> really awful. I fell into you. And in perfectly awkward fashion. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, let me lube up. No. <laughs> Her lips smack on mine. Jesus Christ, I can't look over there. Here, you can have a... No, I don't want that. <laughs> no. <gasps> I haven't even said anything yet. Mm. <laughs> ah. Phew. Black. Oh, you did that on purpose, didn't you? No, no that I... Uh, that's... It's... That impromptu makeout session was... <laughs> I'll do the terrible conditions of your country's roads. Yeah. A likely excuse. You just wanted to steal my first kiss, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> How would I even know that would be your first kiss? Uh, well, um, uh, you used some of your mystic protagonist powers, didn't you? What in the hell are you rambling on about? I don't even know anymore. Uh, all I know is you stole my first kiss. How will you make it up to me? Make it up to you? Are you serious? You were the one who fell into me. So I guess you could say this was your fault. Well, it, it doesn't count. You hear me? I'll deny it if anyone asks. Sure, but deep down, you'll always know you liked it. <laughs> Jesus. I wink at her. Hoping to make Yugi girl stew in anger a little bit more. I'm going to kill you and uh, feed you a dog, Kami Ho. Kumi Ho, what is a Kumi Ho? A uh, Kumi Ho is a Question sinister me. fox that can turn into a beautiful woman and eats the heart of men, especially protagonists. Hey, I watched a Korean drama with, uh, although they, they pronounce it with a G instead of a K. I watched, I watched a, a Korean Ooh. drama with a girl who was a, uh, this fox in question. Whoa. It was pretty good. Dude. Now, one of these days I'm gonna have a big long rant about Korean dramas. Hell yeah. They're so good. So, a beautiful woman who kills men. Guess you have some competition. Uh, uh, just shut up and uh, scoot over some. I just want to take a nap. It's going to be a long ride. Say please. P please? Well, since you said please, heh, <laughs> get some rest. Heh! <laughs> Fucking got him! <laughs> Made her say please! <laughs> that sounds like a like you've activated my trap car style. <laughs> yeah, like honestly, like ha. <laughs> <laughs> I scoot over to the side of the seat and before I can say anything, Yugi girl has already plopped her head in my lap. Oh hey, can't block my I use your lap for a pillow? Oh no, of course, go right ahead. Thanks for asking. Oh hush already. You stole my first kiss from you from me. <laughs> you owe me a this how much? Do I now? Are you sure this is enough? Ooh, woo. It's all fine. I pat her head softly. Oh, wait, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> and she smiles. Do you like that? Well, I, I don't hate it or anything. After a few minutes, Yugi Girl dozes off in my lap. What am I gonna do with you, Yugi Girl? What am I gonna do? <laughs> I keep stroking her hair and I feel my own eyes getting heavy as the car rolls softly along the surprisingly well-paved road. That is road. surprising. 
time passes. Oh, wake up, a sleepy pants. Well, and what's well, on? Time to go on a date. I forgot how much my ears have to suffer in games like this. She seems pretty happy. That's unusual. Great. What should we do first? Oh, it's a pretty hot already. How about we go to the beach first? We can see the rest of the town after. Maybe visit the shrine or look at some shops. Sounds like a plan. Let's hit that beach. Or Hell let's hit the beach. yeah. You girl <laughs> giggles. Wait, giggles? <laughs> that's, that's a giggle? Yeah. Is that right? That totally doesn't match her personality. Or vocal cords. I need to have a serious talk with whoever's in charge here. Oh, are you coming with me? Or are you planning on staying in the car the whole time? And miss out on some ham-fisted beach episode? No way! Hell yeah. Well, let's get that changed then. Holy crap, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Understood. Lead the way. Understood. Good to go. Good to go. <laughs> oh fuck, is he a real beach? I'm sure this is a real picture. I don't even need to offer out my hand as she's already grabbed it and is taking me over to a small hut just off the shoreline. Maybe calling it a hut is a bit much. It's more like an Yeah, house. someone find the original photo of this. Worse, there's only one, so we'll be going one at a time. What? Why is that bad? Because it's more efficient to go at the same time. I'm gonna guess. Yeah. Wait, why are we both just standing outside of it? Well, what are you waiting for? I was waiting on you, ladies first and all that. Would you... Would you mind going first? Wait a minute. After all that bravado about the glorious leader and dragging me to a beach, you're scared to go put it on first? What, what does that mean, scared to... I don't understand. Is she gonna get raped? No, she's just scared to put it on. Look, I'm a nervous, okay? I, I've never worn a bikini in front of a man before. I'll fucking put on a bikini right now. No thanks. Give me a bikini! No I'll thanks. put it on! No thanks. I ain't afraid! You think I'm scared? You think I'm scared? I'm not. I'll put it on. Just bring me one. <laughs> no thanks. I'll fucking wear one. Let's go. I believe it. All right. Yeah. Good. <laughs> good. I don't need to visually <laughs> confirm that. I just uh... Uber's not here. I've only worn it in front of John, and I don't like wearing it in front of her either. I can understand maybe being shy around a guy, but why your own sister? Because she always gets all the attention. Hey, beach we beach have episode. to do a calendar sheet, by the way. We do. How and when we are do, we gonna put that? We together? have to do it soon. We gotta do the. We gotta do the first two. We could do the. We have. I think we have enough for the first two months, and then for this month, we'll figure something out. Well, for like December. Like, I know. I have some good ideas. Is this gonna be a twenty twenty calendar, or like what is this gonna be? Uh, I guess it'll be a twenty twenty calendar because we got to spend the rest of this year to do it. Yeah. 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 Yeah, right. so it'll be a 2020 calendar. Now, I'll talk to you about that, actually. I, I forgot. I completely forgot. Yeah. But I have some plans for that. I think someone may be a little jealous. What's that? that? She always tells me that they haven't grown at all. I keep trying to tell her there's more to a woman than breast size, but she just laughs. The guys are always staring at her. Sometimes I wish they'd stare at me. Not that I like that or anything. This might be the first time I've ever heard a woman say they wish guys would stare at her. Usually most women wish guys would stop staring. I guess it would be uncomfortable, but it also does sort of validate you in a way. Speaking of uncomfortable, this sudden honesty from you girl has me uncomfortable. <laughs> okay, I'll go in first and get changed. Oh, thank you. I am grateful. For your understanding. Think nothing of it. I won't be long. I go inside the outhouse. The first thing I notice is that it's freaking dark inside. 
You think I would be surprised at this? Considering <laughs> the lack of updated infrastructure I've seen in Pyongyang and the rest of the country. Yet here I am creating a monologue at how annoyed I am at the lack of electricity. Why didn't the builders put a sky window in or something? Or someone could have, re could have requested an outhouse scene with a candle or torch, hint hint. Still, a few minutes later. Oh, you're the fucking silkies, dude. I forgot. <laughs> I'm in my silkies, Damn. ready to heat, hit the beach. Those silkies. Now, do I play it cool for Miss Sinner, or do I heat things up by giving the gun show? Oh, an boo! Well, a minimalist approach sometimes leaves the greatest impact, or so I've been told. I'm so skeptical about that. Since it was just some bullshit a congressman told us when it came to cutting Marine Corps funds, though. Oh my god, this is turning into a whole thing. <laughs> oh yeah, you taxpayers complain every time the court gets a new uniform. But did you know that we, the grunts, actually had to buy them with our own money? Yeah, ain't that bullshit? Anyway, no need to show off like those Navy flyboys. Oh, are you okay in there? You didn't uh, fall in, uh, did you? Oh, is that the image? Let's take a look. Oh, nice! Wow. There it is! That is it. Oh, it just showed automatically. Oh, yeah, I'm just taking a bit. Bless her! Oh, well, uh, come on out already so I can uh, get a change. I guess that's my cue. I push open the door and slowly step out. I, I guess you're acceptable for an American. Well, that seems like a very bland reception. Ju Wait. Just take the compliment. Why did this? Oops. Your face betrays you. Why is it stuck? Whoa, there? it's stuck. H Hello? It? Hold on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, oh. Eh. Let's just refresh this thing. We got it. We got it. Uh. Hello? It's broken on there, though. It is broken on there. Let's just save really quickly. Uh, we have to get out. Let's just restart the game. I don't like how it's like that. <laughs> I don't like how it's saved like that. It's not good. Not good. <laughs> not good at all. Oh, boy. The uh, game might be broken. Uh, the menu. Scene. We're just going to quit it. Uh, Reload the whole game. Just in case. You know what they say, sometimes games don't work very well. Okay, so far so good. Continue. Alright, let's- oh good, okay good. This is the preview, that was fucked up. All Bless. Right. I have no idea what you are saying at all. Sorry, idiot. Remind me again why I put up with a you. Deep down, you know I'm Kawhi. Better be careful. If your ego inflates too much more, you won't be able to get back into the outhouse to change. Yeah, and if it infl inflates past that, I would just float away across the border the separatist Korea. Uh, keep a babbling and you just might. I'm going to change now. Try not to miss me too much. I'll try. But your bubbly presence is like a beacon of light in the night. Specifically, a flashlight from another marine going firewash time, bitch. <laughs> that was awful. And yet, I've heard worse pickup lines. So have I. With that, she walks into the outhouse and slams a door behind her. Pretty sure she's mumbling something about the Baca American outside as she changes. There's someone who complained about me taking so long to get ready. Yugi Girl hasn't exactly been the model of speed changing herself. Damn. It's been, it's been 10 She's minutes. She's dead. And I'm pretty sure she hasn't made a peep. Yeah, and I'm the one taking too long. You okay in there, Yugi Girl? It's been 10 minutes. I'm not fine. Just taking my time, okay? Taking your time? Have you even changed into your swimsuit yet? Yes. Are you coming down with a sudden case of shyness? 
I already told you, I've never won a swimsuit in front of a man before, so I'm a little nervous, okay? Would it help if I close my eyes before you walk out? A little. Okay, I have my eyes closed. Come on and tell me to open them when you're ready. What if I'm never ready? Then you'll have to leave me around Pyongyang describing everything around <laughs> in a text box like some sort of low-budget visual novel. Okay, I'm coming out. I hear the door open slowly and her muffled footsteps coming out of the outhouse. I think... I think I'm okay. You can open them now. She's not there. Oh. <laughs> Sleep. Uh, do, do I look okay? Okay, she's hotter than a Willy Peat shell going off in a crowded market square. I don't know what that, that <laughs> what is. What the fuck? Yugi girl looks fantastic, though. I mean, she's not as filled out as her sister, but there's a little something for everyone in this game, you know? <laughs> Good to know. Pretty funny. <laughs> I'm getting changed. Why does her body proportions look really wrong to me? Her... Mm. It's like, uh, it's like they took, it's like they took Jong's, like, model and then, like, cut out the big breasts, and now she has, like, a way bigger, like, lower yeah, half. Yeah, just looking at that right now, like, it's just, like, the perspective or something that's weird. Isn't that weird? Or maybe it's just the angle, I don't know. It just looks like she's bigger than she really is, or a little longer, too. Yeah, I don't know. Whoa, hold up, you girl, don't mistake my sounds for disapproval. I was... Monologuing. <laughs> I don't understand. Yugi girl, you look great. You have nothing to worry about. Like, it's not as obvious in this, yeah, this angle, but it's still a little off. And to be honest, I guarantee you the guys are staring at you. You just can't see them. She looks like a boy. Yeah. A little something for everyone. Yeah. That's, literally what, that's what the game said. <laughs> Again, I don't understand. Could you just speak up plainly? Sorry, I just mean that you don't have anything to worry about. Thank you. I feel a lot better. I was a word. I wasn't attractive. Yeah, like it's stretched. It totally yeah, is. It stretched. is. It's like really weird. Maybe she is a trap. Or maybe he is a trap. We'll see. You are, though. Maybe you need to lighten up on the scenario routine. Now let's hit the beach. They're already on the beach. Yo, we head on over to the beach. I must admit, it's the same fucking background. The ocean is exceptionally clean and blue here. Hope it stays that way. They could probably actually make money off tourism with this ocean. Well, if they ever got over the whole build nukes and piss off the entire world thing. I spread out the towels and put up the umbrella. It's then I notice we're forgetting something. Hey, you girl, did you bring any sunblock? No, I'm afraid we didn't have any. Do we need it? Sunburns are no joking matter. There we go. Do you want to know how much of a tan I got after a nine months employment in the baking Afghan sun? If you're so worried, they may just have some at the store over there. Better lead the way. They might freak out if I go alone, if I'm not shot first. Well, I can't have you shot after being so nice and told me about the swimsuit. Ooh, oh, that's look a cool looking store. Alright, Uber. Uber! Uber! You need to find me this photo, please. Oh. Again! Oh, that's not you. I mean, me. Again, my hand is grabbed and I'm led to the store. Well, what's being passed is a store. I mean, it looks like they have quite yeah, a lot of stuff. Yeah, it's like a pretty stocked store. Man, oh, it's making me hungry. It's making me want these snacks. Look at all those snacks. I want her to put her clothes back on so I don't have to look at it anymore. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the store is state run. It's small, sparse, and the cashier is wearing an army uniform. Oh, and he has a rifle slung over his shoulder. Because, you know, what if you have an engaged invading naval in infantry in between shifts? I suppose that's one way to discourage shoplifting. Well, this shop was specifically to serve foreign tourists, but we can't be too careful with foreigners. So I need protection. I thought you said you were done. Yeah, I'll have one more. He's lying! I'm just hungry. Ooh. 
Oh, that one was very tomatoey. Um. Um. Yes. Maybe if you all didn't confiscate t-shirts you deem as anti-Korean propaganda, you wouldn't need state-run shops like this. I am not having another discussion about us taking your t-shirt. Though, I have to admit, if you wanted to get foreigners spending money in your shops, confiscating half of their stuff on the way is one way to do it. I'm going to let that one slide, but only because you complimented my swimsuit. Let's just find the sunblock and go. There's not a lot in this store, which means it's What are you talking about? This is like packed, dude. I like have a feeling that this is just like a normal shop that they take a picture of. Cause there's also little shops like that. Uber, I need a photo of this, please. I mean, what's the name of the beach? I don't know. You're the one who found the original photo. <laughs> yeah, but that's a very good point. Yeah. Which means the selection leaves a lot to be decided. Or or a nerd might beat him up to it. There was a fierce competition last time, if I remember. Mm -hmm. Just like everything else in this country. There's only one bottle of sunblock, and it appears to be past his sell-by date. And it's only SPF 2.5. 2.5 what? Boot. That's like not even like... That's not even a... <laughs> yeah. That's it's... nothing. That's literally nothing. Well, beggars can't be choosers. Literally. Damn. There's no choice here. I pick it up and pay the nice, heavily armed cashier, and we're on our way back. Just a warning, this bottle won't survive the day. We're gonna have to reapply this early and often. How early and often do you think? I'd say by the time we're done applying the first coat, <laughs> it'll be past time for a new coat. Whatever. I'm just gonna go down and relax. Would you like me to apply the sunblock to your back? Is that some sort of excuse to get your hands on me? Typically it would, but now I'm just looking out for you. Oh, and I suppose afterwards you want me to rub it on you? Well, yeah, I don't want to sunburn either. Hmm. Well, we should have gone indoor skiing. Maybe next trip. Or you could just wear a t-shirt. <laughs> no big deal. Nobody else is like, who cares, dude? Just wear a t-shirt. You'll be lucky if you ever get another date. Yugi Girl turns around and lets me apply the sunblock to her back. In turn, she does the same to me. Afterwards, we finish slattering up and lay down on the Ugh. umbrella on our towel. I can't stand the texture of sunscreen on my skin. Slathering. I, do, I don't like it at all. Why? I don't like it. I just don't like the feeling of it on my skin. It really like. So what do you do if they go out in the sun? I don't wear sunscreen. You don't wear sunscreen? I, should, I guess I don't either. I have a natural... I, like, I don't even, like, go in the sun that often anyway. Yeah, that's true. But that, that that's why you have to apply it more than the normal just, average person. Yeah. I'm more I sensitive just, to I just the don't, because I hate, I hate the feeling of it. Do you get sunburned easily? I'm assuming you do. Not necessary. Not, like, easily, but I will get sunburned if I'm, like, oh, I guess you're not day. out enough to get sunburned. Yeah. It depends. Is it okay if we nap for... It's all she does while I'm trying to sleep. But I keep sleeping. And then take a quick dip in the ocean. Oh, Hi. hello, hurtful, deranged. Nice, hello. Welcome, Welcome to, the stream. to the experience. Yellow has no clue what's happening. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nerd. <blessed>. Nerd. <laughs> nerd, no. nerd, you're so good. <laughs> Thank nerd. you, nerd. <laughs> Everybody give a shout out to nerd. Oh, bless up. Oh, thanks for the follow. Wow. Much appreciated. I told you, this isn't an excuse. <laughs> this isn't an excuse for you guys to start fucking segregating chats, okay? <laughs> and with that, she smiles and closes her eyes. Guess I'll do the same. You guys what, came to the beach just to sleep? Are you serious? <laughs> Mysterious voice. Do you want to be the mysterious boy? Sure, I don't know what to do. Um, yeah, just be mysterious with your vo voice. That, That is not the whole point. That's my point, is that I don't agree with that. Okay, um, what's a mysterious... I think that's the only thing that's going to happen. Well, we'll figure it out. Uh, I can go... I know, I, I know what to do. Robot time. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> 
can blocks. <laughs> no, I can't do it. I can't do it. It's just. Alright, I gotta pull this one down for the, the mysterious voice. Alright, let's just. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. Stand up. Because I don't want to stand. Can blocks can. Can blocks can. You're in danger. <laughs> Alright, I gotta pull this up. What the fuck? <laughs> this some sort of dream? Yeah, we just want to control the platform. I don't, I'm not fucking segregating shit. Yeah, see, that's where the mixer chat comes into Discord. And I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to see if I can figure out a way so it goes the other way as well. But it's, apparently it's more complicated. Gunnery Sergeant something. I don't know what it says. Gunnery Heart, Sergeant Hartman. Hartman. Heart, Heart, Hartman. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. Or I guess they sound the same. <laughs> I mean, I'll give you a, a deeper voice. Pretty much. Did I get the ominous voice thing right? It was okay. I've heard scarier. <laughs> like Yukino's voice. Whoa! What? It's the better maggot! Damn! Sunny's appearing in front of me! <laughs> ah! Gunny! What the hell are you doing here? Holy fuck. Yeah, this is a pretty wild game. Do not give me that shit, maggot! Damn. You are in danger, you limp dick fuck nugget! <laughs> Jesus Christ, why is he yelling at me like this? <laughs> God damn it, Gunny, get out of my dream! Oh, thanks for the follow, Pokey Leader 9699. Nine. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you sound like those fucking IVRs. Like. Yeah! <laughs> 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 I guess you're struggling to read the numbers. Oh, that was completely weird and unnecessary. You okay over there, Yuki Girl? Looking over, I notice Yuki Girl isn't there. Only then do I notice the splashing in the ocean. It looks like Yuki Girl is having some fun swimming. Really? Post the pictures I can see. Wow, I guess she does know how to have fun. She glances my way and notes I'm awake and waves me over, so I head into the water. Kinda cold, but not too bad. Oh, glad to see you're awake. I was afraid you wouldn't get a chance to go swimming. Why would somebody go to the beach, sleep first, and then start swimming? Why would you, yeah, why would you not go swimming, and then... Get tired? And then go to sleep. And Welcome to, to the experience, Van Borsum. <sighs> what was I up? Or Van... <sighs> Van... That was a real yawn. No, I was right, I was right. Van Borsum, I was right. Oh, about an hour or so, unfortunately, the diver came and woke me up. The driver. The <laughs> diver. Not the dry. not the diver, the driver. <laughs> the driver also We have dies. to head back as soon as Glorious Leader has put the whole country on high alert. Oh yeah, also you can't do the up carrot anymore, because it's just like... <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Messages won't set on the site. Ooh. What? Yeah, they will. I, this is why I, di I didn't like this idea, but it's okay. I'll, I'll, we can put up a poll later and see what people something. think. Good. Oof, sad. I mean, I guess it is a beta. It is a beta. Also, if, a beta if, if, if what it's doing is literally creating a oh, web no, there's book, still, like... People here. No, because it depends on the timing. If, if it, all it's doing is creating a webhook so people send messages and then deleting it, that's like fucking nightmarish, my dude. I don't know. And the performance is never gonna be that good. I didn't make it, so. Anyway. We that's have fun. to head back as soon. Glorious Lita has to put the whole country on high alert. I can actually disable the webhooks. But then people won't have their colors. Oh, that's that's what it's for? Yeah, the webhooks I is for. It was... No, it's to match their color and their their username and their like oh like just to their, grab their profile yeah info. just to grab their profile info. Whoa, whoa damn first time somebody pronounced it right i am the listen listen i'm the master of the english language as everybody <laughs> knows can we so of course edit that, that in into a montage of him of pronouncing course something? of course i would say it correctly you're welcome you're welcome the thing is, like, I mean, we, we probably will be making our own chat. I just don't think this interim solution is really going to cut. But it's okay. We can vote on it later. I don't yeah, I can know. just get rid of the, uh, 
the web hooks next time. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, like if you guys want to continue testing or just like not do it, I don't know. You guys can figure it out. If we don't get home before a certain time, we'll have to spend the night either at a hotel or have to camp out somewhere. Sounds serious. What happened? Seems there has been a national emergency yet again. It appears the glorious leader has run out of imported French wines, and therefore under alert until next shipment can come. That doesn't seem to warrant martial law. I mean, that kind of makes sense. But I get, like, yeah, I was, I was very precise in my reading as I... Like an IVR. <laughs> Reports are incomplete, but Gloria's leader will institute such a drastic action unless it was justified. <clears throat> I guess I'll bury that gift deep, deep in my big bag at the house. Mm -hmm. Nothing important, carry on. Well, either way, let's not let that ruin our fun. We should swim a little before changing and heading home. And with that, we splash around, have a couple of swimming races, and generally have a good time. Do we not get to see that? <laughs> no. Right, it's just well, low budget. That's we just budget. generally have a good time. We just generally have a good It's very general. Or try to, anyway. My tension of being in this country grows by the minute. Afterwards, we get changed, and we're back in the car, heading for Pyongyang. So, Kwood, do we have to, like worry about any any more scenes or or, or are we okay yeah because we skipped past one of them yeah we we went through one already i wish we could have stayed a little longer there's a nice little shrine in that area i mean you can technically wait there's cutscenes mm, this vn is not as high budget as you think it is yeah Van Borsum. <laughs> Some VNs that we play do have cutscenes. Not this one in particular. But not this one, unfortunately. So, you know. Okay. Uh, did you read this? Yes. Okay. We could have made a wish. Well, there are other ways to make a wish. Dandelions, falling stars, even the digits on the clock. One of those things didn't sound like the others. If you have a digital clock somewhere, you wait for the numbers to align. It was a joke? Okay, I didn't know if it was a joke or not, because some games we actually play, there are cutscenes. Yeah. Like, fully anime cutscenes. Like, and it's very impressive. We're blown away by the, yeah. the quality. I'm like, damn, I'm watching weeaboo cartoons. Next-gen Chinese cartoons. Yeah, but apparently, the, yeah, so... I thought you were serious, because that's a real thing. <laughs> uh, you wait for the numbers to align to a time like 11 11, then you make a wish. Well, that seems fucking stupid. Why do people do that? People do that, apparently. Why? I don't know. If anything, they should be like making a wish on 9 11, not 11 11. Why 9 11? Because it's a day of remembrance, so maybe the ghosts can wish us, wish us, uh, grant us our <laughs> three wishes. <laughs> I wish you would have had a wish. Right? <laughs> Um, that's how ghosts this is work. You. Yeah, they wish for you to have a wish. <laughs> Get more wishes. Yeah. And they have to be uh, products of a tragedy. That's. I'll give it a try sometime, but would you mind letting me use your lap as a pillow again? I could use another nap, bitch. She you might be only a... nap. You only nap. She doesn't do anything else productive. Dude, in this it's just game, so boring that she has to sleep. She might just be sleep deprived. I know the feel. No worries. I don't want to talk to you, so I'm just gonna sleep. <laughs> That's basically what she's saying. I'm, I'm gonna be powering down. Yeah, I'm just gonna turn off for a bit. And with that, she lays her head in my lap again. And we're heading home in the same way we went to the beach. I get the feeling the whole national emergency thing is just more <gasps> propaganda. I'm really tired. To make sure the Korean populace know knows who's really in control here. I mean, maybe. It really blows. The two people I've interacted with most seem really nice. They deserve better than being on a false high alert. Yeah, they're two people in the entire country. 
Looking up, I think I see the driver staring back at me. Oh shit, dude! In the rear view mirror. He's onto us. He knows. If he knows that I notice, he obviously doesn't care because he makes no motion to stop looking at me. Oh damn, dude! I'm not sure what to make of it. Maybe I'm just paranoid, and sleepy. Third night here, second after having been out all day with one of my chaperones, or hostesses. Girlfriends? Maybe. No. Not literally Maybe. way too early for that. They sure seem intent like, on keeping me to themselves. Yeah. Are they hoping to keep me here in Korea, or are they hoping I'll sneak them out? Neither seems very likely. Maybe I'm just overthinking this. Perhaps grabbing hands, calling <laughs> outings, dates, and falling asleep on foreign men is custom here. Yeah, I'm not overthinking things. Speaking of thoughts, I think mine are about to be interrupted. Well, thanks for the amazing follow. Thank you for the follow, fan oh, or so. Is our living room floor more comfortable than my bed? Loaded question, but I assume you meant it as an innocent one? Well, maybe not. <laughs> anyway, I came to see if you were busy this evening. Seeing as the Pyongyang nightlife involves explaining to soldiers what I'm doing out in the street at night, Without getting killed or arrested, I say my agenda's pretty clear. Oh, it's not always like this. I'm sure at some point we can go somewhere in the evening. I hope so. Anyway, did you have something in mind for this evening? Yes, I was hoping you would help a Yugi girl with her English tonight. She really needs as much help as possible. But for some reason, she doesn't do very well learning under my guidance. I think maybe having a kawaii American man might help her. Not sure what being kawaii has to do with it, but I'm glad to hear I'm not the ugly American. Ha! <laughs> well, your girl has taken a liking to you. She's just never been good with her feelings. Color me Fifty Shades, not surprised. When she was 13, a boy who had a crush on your girl actually got the nerve to confess to her. She actually liked him as well. So they dated? Well, no. She didn't know how to handle the, the sudden confession, and she ended up shooting him with the pellet gun. Pellet gun? Why the hell she didn't have one, one on her in the first place? I mean, do kids here just carry those to class? We prefer our students carry 9mm compacts. That's pretty funny. AR or AR-15 assault rifles. Yeah. The civilian version. He confessed to her at a small arms practice range. You sure he was in love and not depressed? <laughs> it seems like a suicide attempt was made there. Don't be mean. My sister has faults. Has her faults. But she could be sweet. And is certainly not bereft. Bereft? I thought you had the master of not English. Not bereft one. of womanly charms. <laughs> I suppose that's true. She's kawaii her own way. Anyway, I would like your help... Well, fuck. I would like you to help her with her English after dinner. I'll have everything you need ready. Fair enough. I promise to help her after all. Anyway, maybe I'll finally get some respect as her teacher. Fucking respect! You probably should have put all your hopes in one basket for that idea. I'm not sure how, but you mix up two old sayings and actually made a pretty decent new one after that. Beginner's luck? Probably. Still, it was kind of kawaii. Easy there. You're supposed to be flirting with Yugi -Oh tonight. I thought I was teaching her, not flirting with her. Ah, uh, there's a difference? A pretty clear one? Well, maybe one day you will understand. Don't put all your hopes in one basket. So mean. I'll have Yugi get waiting and ready after dinner for your tutoring. She walks in the room she's sharing with Yugi girl, but I'm pretty sure I saw her turn back. <laughs> wink at me. <laughs> the uh, alpaca wink. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Always now. <laughs> it's like a huge wind-up animation and everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then only if the person's like up there. <laughs> Teaching Yugi girl English. This should be interesting. Of course, give me a loaded gun to a gorilla could be interesting, too. That would be interesting. I'd watch that. And at least you'd have a fighting chance that time. I'd watch that. That would be entertaining. Better take a quick nap before marching into this battle. Better take a quick nap before anything. 
And we're going to end it there, and we're going to move on to Jackbox. Okie dokie. Because we have more games to give away. You made me click twice. <laughs> more games. What are more we playing? More code. Random Steam. Random Steam. No, what are we playing? I don't know. Random Steam. What do people want to play random for Steam. the random Steam games? How many random Steam games do we got? Random amount of a, random Steam A random Steam amount. Games. Maybe four. Or three. Maybe four or three. What? Yeah. So anyway, we're back doing random Steam game giveaway. So, you know, if you want to win, win at Jackbox. Just be good. Uh, what do we want to play, though? Um, I really need to come up with a list. Jackbox. Oh, Lord. Save me. Bruh. Go to jackbox.tv. Let's play some bunny man. On your on your mobile device. You're not doing a good job of explaining this. Or what this shut is. up. On your mobile device or your computer. And the code, we'll put the code up on the screen. What do you mean, nerd? If if Ben Parson was, <laughs> then they would know how to play. Yeah, that's true. So and then we'll put the code up on the screen, you enter that code in on the website. And it's like a game that you play with like everyone else. Okay. The actual explanation came at the end. Does that not make sense? Well, because he asked what's Jackbox, he should explain what the game was instead of how to get in. Well, because Jackbox is a collection of games and not just one specific game. All right. I, I'm inclined to believe the master of the English language. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just going to defer to him. If people don't choose a game, I'm choosing. Ooh. Big oof. People don't want games. People don't want games. People want to watch us play Bunny Man. Why am I giving away games if people don't want them? Well, didn't you win a game last week? Why do people... Why Why should I give them away? You sit out of Jackbox nine weeks out of ten. Why did I ask? So I guess when week ten shows up, you're going to be playing. That's then. a good point. You know what? Let's not play Jackbox. Show me a list. Yeah, we do have to. We do have to do like a, a, a exclamation mark Jackbox for a list of games. I'll, I'll. I think. I think. I think I'll put that together over the weekend. I'm going. I'm just not playing because I gave the game codes. That's fair. BB you says she feels play. like garbage. That's. Also I mean, that's fair. also fair. But nobody else wants to play. Well, what do you want to play then? I want to play. Dead. I guess we'll just go to. Go back to stay safe. Super. Oh. Steve DPRK. Stay, stay, DPRK. Yeah. I guess we can. I guess we're just going to go hard. I guess so. On stay, stay. You know if we play a different game? What's a different game that we can play? I want to play DPRK. I mean, I guess we could just do that. Just going to go on. Literally only two people said they weren't playing. I also asked Bloodborne for suggestions of games and nobody responded. I don't think I had Bloodborne on my... I'm not doing it now. You have it on your PS4, don't you? Uh, I think so. I don't know if it's still installed. Anyway, and that was painful. Maybe because we were so tired. I wasn't doing very well. Also, I think, yeah. No, I'm not, I'm not playing Blood Bowl. <laughs> if anything, if we're playing something on a different console, I'd be playing better games. <laughs> Oof. Get destroyed. Alright. Let's I continue. forgot there's like a theme song. Maybe they can't respond because it says fail to send message. I mean, maybe. They could always take it. But that means I have to do more work. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, it does mean I have to do more work. Well, I guess we're just going back to it. Thanks for the meal, you girl. Again, you've outdone yourself. Best meal I've had in Korea yet. Okay, I think your chat died now. Are you serious? Yeah. Page unresponsive? Uh, it's page unresponsive, that's probably why. Reload. <laughs> it's not working very well. It's working fine. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me just scroll up. Hold on. I missed a lot of stuff. 
No. You also, you have me here now. I asked for a list. No, I don't have a list. Spider yeah, I'm not putting Ooh, list. Spider-Man would be good, but it's fine. Uh, there's a fallback in place. Lego Star Wars. <laughs> I, actually, it's a good game. Lego I just, Star Wars is good. I just don't have it. <laughs> I, I enjoy the Lego games. I love the Lego Star Wars games. games. It's really fun. Um, uh, Mike isn't a man of people. He doesn't want to give out the codes I donate. Yeah, don't we have to give out the codes? Like, Don't we yeah, have they to don't play inspire. something else? I guess. So we just hang out to them until people That's will cooperate with me. Sorry, I'm just catching up here. Lego Overwatch. That'd be kind of a cool game to play. If it's like Lego Overwatch with lore, I'd See, actually play the shit I out of I really want a Lego Overwatch game. Yeah, like, cause cause it's like single player. We I don't would, have to deal with the first person format. You could just tell the story. I would absolutely play that. That'd be really fun, I think. Yeah. Yeah, somebody should tell Blizzard to make that. And maybe instead of making stupid phone games. Day one of asking Mike to play Lego. You know, maybe we, we will play Lego Star Wars one, one, one of these days. You know? Maybe during actual life. I can add that as one of the games. Whoa. Because it's co-op. It's co-op, yeah. So there you go. Yeah. All right. Let's continue. Are we continuing? Yeah. Random Modern Warfare 2 modded lobby on Rust. Damn, I haven't heard that in a long time. On Rust. <laughs> I'm going to 1v1 you on Rust. <laughs> what even is Rust? I don't know. I keep hearing like the whole Rust meme. Like, was that that game created by id Software? I mean, there is a game called Rust. Yeah, so like, is that what people no, no, but this refer is a... to? Or is this no, like no, a no, 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 this game? is a... Let me show you, okay? What? Maybe there's an images. It's the map. It's this map. Oh, it's a map. Yeah, it's the Rust map. This is like the one... This is the one you want in Modern Warfare 2. In, in one, it was a... Uh, it's called like Shipman, oh. I think? Yeah, so in, in Modern Warfare, like they were called it before, people would always 1v1 in shipment. It was a small no, map. Changed it and then Modern Warfare 2, they would play Rust. Because it's a, it's like a... It's a small map. It's a small map, yeah. I get it. You know, 1v1 knife only, you know? Tis the way. I thought that was chemistry. No, the, the, no you can knife only in... in in Modern Warfare as well. Or right. pistols only, or whatever. I guess what that makes do. sense. I never really played Interventions only, no throwing knives is very common, actually. Interventions <laughs> only. Yeah, interventions like what the, are the, interventions? The, the, the sniper. The, uh, this one. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's you, the you can, meme like, one. You get quick scope, yeah. That's, that's the meme one. Dude, right I was though. fucking a god with a quick scope. Stand still so I get 360 with an inter Oh my god, I'm bringing back <laughs> memories. And I used to play uh, the search and destroy mode, which is kind of like uh, CS, like in the sense that if you died, you just stayed dead. And there's mm -hmm. like bombs you have to defuse or oh, plant. Yeah. And because you died, if you die, you just like watch the rest of your team play the game, all right? But if you're the only person alive, if you're the only Very person alive on the team, your entire team... Oh, yeah. will have to watch <laughs> you and all their hopes Dude, and dreams. I know that feel. And then everyone's in voice chat <laughs> just screaming to get <laughs> this shit do. done. Yeah. And then, like, and what happens is, like, because I'm the only one alive a lot, I would just, like, run and, like, try to, like, defuse the bomb. And then at the very last second, I would, like, 360 throw a grenade and kill myself. And then it's just, like, screaming coming out of the fucking <laughs> headset. Ah! Look at the 12 year old kids, like, like cursing everything from Why? me to my mom to my extended family. It was. <laughs> Top. <laughs> it was That's really incredible. fun. I love trolling in that game. That was great. Okay, uh, back to the game. Yeah, I was a, okay. I remember when Modern Warfare Two first came out, uh, and like the throwing knife was a thing. I just threw one. Like this was the meme. You would just like look up and it's like, <laughs> right? The and meme. then and then like uh, the the fucking kill cam. This is like the origins of kill cams. The kill cam would just show you doing this. And then, like, it would follow the <laughs> knife really all funny. the way across the map until it hit somebody, and then people get super mad, right? Before, before <laughs> I everybody's actually remember like, that. Yeah, you just... I, I'm remembering that now. Yeah. Yeah, that was... Yeah, okay. Okay, I, I understand. Or you could, uh... Or you'd have, like, the, the new tube, right? It's, like, the greatest disrespect when you just... <laughs> and then... No, no, and then, and then it escalated to 360... Into the fucking throwing <laughs> knife. Escalated. You know, you just. Whoosh. Dude, that game was great for a lot of reasons. Mostly because people would just like get super mad. And, fucking incredible. And dude. then you would have the fucking uh, what's it called again? Uh, shit, how can I not remember? Because I always used used to call the Junkrat uh, death this the um, martyrdom, the one that pissed me off the most. Where you like when you die, you like just like drunk and Oh yeah. Yeah. 
Dude, that game was so easy, so you had to do something to make it, like, new to Macar- Yeah, think all these- People know what I'm talking about, dude, it's fucking great. Modern Warfare 2 was awesome. It was kind of like- It was kind of like the good balance, because, like, Modern Warfare 4 was really fun, but then, like, after seven kill streaks, you just got nothing. It just oh, told no. you, like, at ten kills, ten kill streak. So you don't get, get it. At twenty-five, else. and that's 25. the gap, by the way, ten, and then it's twenty-five, 25. and it just tells you again. <laughs> and, like, all right. But like in, in the second one, there's like more stuff, but it's not like the, the, the later games where it's just like getting a little fucking ridiculous. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, Junkrat. Junkrat has martyrdom, right? Like the perk. Yeah. Man, I used to love it, like because he had like different builds. You know, it was good. It's good times. Good times. Let's continue. All right. Well. You read this, I think. Yeah. I think. Did you? No. Not read it. Oh well, of course. I have been training in the culinary arts, so it's the least I can do. Think of nothing of it. Look at you getting our bearful with our Americans praise. Yugi girl's cheeks glow red. It's pretty kawaii. I may have the praise or more if that's the reaction it gets. Alright, buddy, calm down. Oh, I am not. He just took me by surprise with his compliments, and that's all. You are such a terrible liar. Dude, I fucking love Commando Pro. That's probably one of my most equipped perks. And because, like, the knife thing is, like, a triggered animation, right? It can look so dumb in kill counts. We just, like, we, we like, run around. Like, there's, there's a guy to your right, and you, like, stab, but because it, like, auto-locks uh -oh. a little bit, it just, like, <laughs> like you would turn around, <laughs> would turn and then just he just, like, that. dies. <laughs> I'm uh, tired, dude. I'm tired. Fucking I've love had... Commando Pro. I had a long week. Oh. Very tired. Oh, you were such a terrible liar. Mike is yawning, maybe because VNs are fun. No, I think I'm just tired. I'm just tired. Now, stopping power is when you're like trying to go hard. Like, you're trying to like try hard. <laughs> Do more damage. Can I ask you for a favor, Ken <laughs> She winks, obviously. Why is that obvious? Of course, you've been such gracious hostesses. What can I do? Can you clean up the table and wash the dishes tonight while I prepare Yugi girl for your <laughs> event? It's time to duel. This evening. Yeah, dude, she's gonna, they're gonna duel, dude. I'd hardly call what we're doing an event, but sure, I'd be glad to clean up. But what's going on? What do you... Think you're preparing me for? Oh yeah, she's gonna teach English like this, you know, where like the girl's sitting down and then the guy is like, like like standing over them and like like doing this, you know? Oh shit! <laughs> like moving their hands around and shit. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Te I'm very like, hey, it's Tedious. Tedious. Ratchet and playing? Clank. Those are good games. I remember playing them on the PS2. You're going to spend some one-on-one -on -one time alone in your bedroom with our guest. What? I am not already for that sort of thing. That'd be way too sudden. And you're setting it up, John? Here's the part of the misunderstanding where you say, but if it's sex with can blocks, I wouldn't mind. Right. If it's sex with can blocks, I would. Hey! I stop attacking me. Good old can blocks. So tricky. Now's about the perfect time for you to fulfill another uh, Cinder trope. Who's running this operation here? Man, yellow, you're really onto the the. How do you know that's yellow? Who, I don't know that's yellow. Who made Dark Souls and Bloodborne? The oh. Japs. Like the studios, not the nationality. Oh, I have no idea. The Japs? Come on, that's your best guess. <laughs> I mean, am I wrong? Mm, well, no. Ah. It's like, is it from software? Am I, am I mixing that up? Team Ninja. PS2. Oh, I love the original Battlefront games. Team Ninja. Okay, right. I, I guess they're right. Nice. Everybody serves flying. Yeah, from software. I don't know. I just haven't. None of the From Software games really like grab me. Ex not good. The uh, what's it called? What's that one game called? The one with like the multiplayer mishap? 
No idea what you're talking about. It's like the one where they like, I don't know. Anyway, that game was maybe kind of interesting, but then I didn't play it because the multiplayer was kind of Epic garbage. games, yeah. Bad Company 2 was very fun. I think Jong is, anyway, dirty as your minds might be, that's not even close to what we're doing. Oh, I mean, you are thinking of something hentai right now, aren't you? I'm under assault from both sides now. Oh, admit it, hentai! <laughs> if I don't admit, you must acquit. Okay. <laughs> no way I am spending any time alone in my bedroom without a creep. What is COO with you? Country Co of offline? Country of offline? Dude, are you bringing it back? The coolest nigga around? Are you bringing it back? I would love to see Country of Offline again. And I would love for you to go on a panel, panic, and then say something completely unrelated to what we do on the stream. Yes. That That's how great. I roll. Actually, we should do a board game stream like one year. Yeah, dude, just I'm one. telling you, we gotta do the uh, Catan one. And then you and then you wouldn't be. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. my god, we can watch. I'm okay, you. here's. Okay, I'm you know what? Expert. Let's Catan. pause this for, for oh a second because I, go. I gotta I go to the bathroom. But. Oh shit. Did you guys know in our presence is a professional settlers of Catan with four years minimum of experience? It's this guy. Tell tell them your win rate. I don't know. I don't remember. It's low. Was it low? <laughs> it's it's so low that when you told me, I actually laughed and I was like, that's not real. I don't remember. <laughs> it's like 90% losses. <laughs> actually, I feel like that's pretty generous. I feel like it was worse than that. Like, you you won so few games compared to the number of games you played that. I was like, there's no way. You have to, like, win some by default, right? Like, or, like, by luck. Because this is four years of me, like... And we had, like, a ritual. Because, like, I would always do... I think I told this story before. I would always, like... Uh, get home, you know, start doing my legal studies homework. Yeah, I was fucking doing legal studies we like, when I was playing. We would, like, get on, like, the Xbox Live party chat, if you remember those days. And then he would, like, start losing. And then this is, like, years of this, until he realized that he <laughs> wasted well, just four years. It. I glitched it for <laughs> half an hour. <laughs> the amount of, the amount of sadness. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go back, I'll be right back. Don't say anything controversial. Right. I gone. never say anything cr controversial. Don't lie either. I don't lie. I'm not gay. Jesus Christ. I'm going to put this away. All right. Well. Well, chat. It's just you. And it's just me. What do you guys want to... Uh, how? First of all, how was your week? How was everybody's week this week? Was it tough? Or was it like, eh? Or, you know. My week was, you know, eh. It was eh. I have a bunch of shit on my phone, notifications on my phone to go through, so I'm just gonna. Just gonna do that. Yo, know, mine was good. Mine was good, thank you. Thank you for asking to your through Zipro mail. It was it was okay, you know? Like it was alright. It wasn't anything special. Or anything. He was just kinda meh. Pretty short! Oh I have a sack! On the night. Why are you talking? About that, that is pretty shitty. Sorry, my dude. Well, he might be British. I don't know. What am I? What am I secretly googling? I don't know. The ending of what? The game. Why would I do that? I don't know. Literally, the only enjoyment I get out of this is the plot. Um. Okay. Oh, I'm back. Let's do this. Wait. How was your week? My week? Yes. Busy. It was busy and boring, and I did a lot of work. That's it. Yeah. That was good. Yeah, it was good. Oh, it was all right. I I wish I played more video games, but I did. So, also, okay. So on Tuesday, oh my God, you guys, I might have a problem. Here's the thing. On Tuesday specifically, I was like 
All right, I'm gonna get work done. I'm gonna play some Overwatch and I'm gonna go to bed. And then what happened was I played Tetris 99 the entire time and then went to bed super late. And then so I stopped playing for the rest of the week. It was like, you start playing, you just don't stop. I don't know. I don't know. How much Siege did I play this oh, week? Oh yeah, that's like a good point. Zero hours. Ooh. But I think I'm gonna figure out those sets. I'm not. With the people. I'm not playing that game until I figure out my sensitivity settings. But once I figure it out, I'll play a little bit more. What did was there to figure out while you just adjust? It? No, no, no. I have some s specific settings. I don't want to lose my muscle memory on the sensitivity I have right now. I don't want to readjust again. I don't have the kind of time like I used to, where I could just like put hundreds of hours into one type of sensitivity and be really good at it. I okay. have to like retain it now. Alright, so you're gonna make I was it the so same. Close. You're gonna make it the same as like what you use in Overwatch, is that what you're saying? Yeah, which is a uh, five at eight hundred DPI, so Wait, so you already know the number? Yeah, but it's not the same in this game. I have to change oh, specific settings. Because you don't have to have like a slider. Like there's a bunch of different numbers. Yeah. I have to do math. Oh shit. You gotta do math? You gotta do math for it. So do that. it's really that, that's, 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 And I can't change the settings like on the fucking like in the game settings menu. I have to go to the config file to change it. That's and then retarded. It's just like a whole thing, dude. Just play controller. Easy. Easy fix. No, I'm playing Overwatch after the stream. Cause Damn. I haven't played much Overwatch either. Uh, Only Tetris okay. ninety nine. Yeah, well, actually, I played more Overwatch because... No, I played an equal amount. Because I played all that Tetris 99 in one night. <laughs> and that's <laughs> the amount of time I yeah. played Overwatch for the whole week. So. Oh my gosh. It's fun. I, I still haven't gotten first yet. Here's my problem. Did I tell you this? Here's my problem know. with Tetris 99. Is that, like, when I get so close... I want to get to, like, top five. Like, okay, no, no. When I get to number two and I need to survive, there is no way to beat... To the get to number one because the person, the other person that's alive is actually good because they're still alive. Because <laughs> they're actually like a legitimate. Yeah, like, I just survived till then. Player. And then they're just like <laughs> easily crushing me. Like, <laughs> that's funny. Goddamn, okay. So what do you actually get when you win in that game? What is it called? I don't know because I've never won. Does anybody, does anybody actually know? Is it called like... like is it a chicken I don't know, dinner? Every, every game has like their own gay thing. So like <laughs> yeah. what is... What is Tetris 99? It's... Tetris 99 is the best BR game out there. Okay, I'm just yeah, gonna put that good. on the record. It's the best one. What's after the what's this, what's the after stream meme tonight? I'm playing Overwatch. Winner winner block dinner. I hope that's it. I hope that's That'd it. That'd be really dumb. If I find out, I'm gonna like cry. Like I'm just gonna like screenshot it and make that my desktop. <laughs> Your desktop wallpaper. I think it's just being on top of the leaderboard. Oh come on, really? It's, it doesn't tell you anything. If you win, you get a blowjob with the developers. That's <laughs> interesting. Uh, it doesn't have a fun name. Tetris isn't that's fun. It's all business. That's super lame. I want to win once, okay? Maybe I just have to play like 4 a.m. where all the no, no, that's where all the pros come out. Shit, okay. Yeah, dude. I gotta play during the day, like when kids are at home. During the day. Oh yeah, that's true. But I'm not at home. Or like the, day. the weekend. Yeah, but sometimes I play during the weekend. I said I'm one. So, so the kids are still being. Yeah. Oh yeah, of course. They have better hand-eye coordination. They have better reaction times, reflexes. Yeah, I'm old. Yeah. I'm old. Fair enough. I have like a fucking like three four hundred millisecond delay to all my shit, <laughs> on average. <sighs> okay, let's I'm continue. So tired, like I'm actually tired today. Let's just have a nap. You be girl. What am I doing? Uh, what is this? Okay, here we go. No, no, no. best battle royale game is Tetris ninety nine. I can't do this by myself because you have to read. Fuck, I'm tired. All right. Okay. No way. Am I? Oh, I already read that. Okay. Agario Battle Royale. I mean, they got... No, no, no. It's all on really Tetris. Win. I can't win. I'll play or Tetris Snake, 99 on stream one day, Snake. guys. Io. So you guys can give me tips. I want tips. I want to get better. It will be fun, you Giko. I think you've had more martial arts training than him anyway. How do you know I didn't have a part-time job as a dojo floor sweeper? Where the Sifu adopted me as his only child and taught me the ways of Taekwon Leap. Mikaris who live in America. Home of slackers who bum on the beach when not sleeping. Everyone knows Americans are fat, lazy bums. Fortunately, I am not. Anyway, I'm gonna help you learn English tonight. 
Oh yeah, I know. I played a lot of Snake Dead IO in the day. <laughs> I know, I've seen you play. Yeah. Always with like a full abundance of confidence, followed immediately by dying, unfortunately. Him teaching me English? A but? No buts about it. I'll meet you in your room in five minutes. Oh, nice. Hell Hey, yeah. this looks like the Maverick City guy. It does, doesn't it? Sister, you must learn English to advance in the people's army. Is and it? our guest is going to help you. Is it that rare that people have to draw the screen? <laughs> yeah, apparently. There's no, like, official screenshots. <laughs> It's just like, you know, nobody sees it. It's a it, myth. So they just assume, yeah. It's like a fucking cave painting. Like, yeah. this. Oh, I'd rather have the sex. At least it'll be over in two minutes. Ooh. English, it takes forever. I think I can last a little longer than two minutes. Both of you hush and go to you girls' room and leave the door open. <laughs> oh, I swear. Oh, wrong voice. Or I swear, if I'd hear you complaining, you girl. You're doing strip English lessons. If he had told me that was on the table, I had offered my services sooner. Oh, let's just get it over with. With that, she forcefully grabs my hand and drags me back to her bedroom. She also defiantly slam slams the door shut and locks it behind her. Honestly. My sister can be a, such an instigator. Just to make sure, we are practicing English and not having sex, right? Yes, we are just studying English. Here's the book we work from. <laughs> That's fine. Everybody's just back on the fucking mixer chat anyway. <laughs> I want to die. <laughs> make that your ringtone. <laughs> Actually, can you, can you guys clip that? I want. I just want to make that a ringtone of something. My ringtone is the Stardew Valley Star Drop Saloon thing. My ringtone is just vibration. You don't even have a ringtone, nice. No, but but I guess the I, I did change my ringtone uh, recently, like a few months ago. I um I put it as the ringtone of that um what's her what's her face again the that. Lady from the To the Moon game. It's a really sad reminder of what that game was. It was really good. Okay, um, she hands me a bright yellow paperback book. On the the failed message, maybe refresh our plan for the new chat room. <laughs> well, what does that mean? Yeah, maybe. Uh, on the front, the title reads "How to Sound Like a Dumb American." Well, that's a good sign. Let's check the copyright date. 1987. Great. It's only three decades out of date, so I guess that's progress. I sit next to her on the bed. I flip open to the bookmark page. How about reading this sentence for a start? Oh, hello. H hello? Everybody, where I should I go to the discotheque? To dance together. That image is almost as awkward as Yuki Girl's pronunciation. I'm not even certain where to begin. I like to blame it on the book, but your pronunciation is atrocious. English is uh, so hard. Why do I need to learn it anyway? I'm not sure. I think we can skip all of this because I remember this. I'm so we can gonna... we can skip through that part. Yeah, we are skipping, don't worry. Skipping ahead until our next place where we haven't. Wow. Oh yeah, I saw her cute anime butthole there. Check this cord. Yes. Yugi Girl has a very pink butthole. I feel like every time I, I uh, alt tab, I am running a risk of this shit freezing. Okay, so this is after the sec- we haven't gone on a second we're date. We're about to right now. No, we're about to go on our third date. This one. If you manage to get past the third date, don't keep going, because I'm not sure about choices and stuff. No, we haven't gone on a second date. Oh, yet. have we not? Okay. Guys, can you help? Alright. 
Uh, you should probably s turn off skip mode. Um, yeah, but I can't do that at this screen. Uh, let's go to the one with Yugi Girl, obviously. I'm just going to keep that on for a second. Let's go to Pablo with Yugi Girl. It's not Pablo. Oh, it's grayed out anyway. Um, is are we on the second date right now or third date? No, because we went, we went, we went to the soccer game. We went to the beach, and this is our third date. Oh, you're right. You're right. I think you're right. This is our third date now. Okay, so we have and the scenes from whatever is coming up here, unless we already passed it. But I don't think. We Thank you. Yes, yeah, so we are on the third date now. Hidden amongst all the Korean named places stands a very, very odd name for a place in East Asia. I've got to see what's behind this. I'm curious as to how a place called Pueblo ended up on a map of Korea. Care to explain? Yes, we passed her butthole. Oh, so that, that was the scene for that so quick? Yeah. We, we passed the uh, anime butthole. <laughs> Alright, we I mean, we go pretty slow. You could probably, you know... We go very slow. You could probably get on past. the light cast. Unless we're speedrunning things. Oh, I cannot do a better than that. I cannot show you. Get the rest, and we'll go there. I never actually said I wanted to go there. <laughs> uh, too late. No back takes. We're going, and that's a final. No back talks. <laughs> yeah. That's. Take backs, and I can't take anything back as I didn't ask in the first place. Oh, you may as well give up. Going to Pablo is one of Eugene's Eugene's Yugi <laughs> Girl's <laughs> favorite tour destinations. Good old Eugene. If you don't go willingly, she'll just drag you there anyway. Well, excuse me. Can you give me the gist of what's there at least? It. Uh... It may be better to just see for yourself. I don't want to spoil Yugi Girl's fun. Yugi Girl has fun outside of picking on me and tormenting her comrades? Of course she does. She also torments me. Oh. It literally just says first places. That is super lame, dude. Wow. Like you need way it's more. worth nothing. It's not even like... Oof. But I still want to see it. That looks so glorious. Not because it's like flashy it's or anything, but I just I've never seen it before. That is pretty lame. I will admit. It's super lame. What the fuck? Yeah. There's no like. Winner winner blocked it. I really. There's can somebody nothing. please like tweet the devs and just be like, can you put like. It, it's got a big one, but we, you know. Where's the catchphrase? It has a big one. I don't care. I just want to see that screen in once in my life. Just one time. And then it's gonna be my in my desktop. <laughs> All right, continue. Oh, that's not a tormenting, Jung. That's a sisterly affection. I've got a big one, if you know what I mean. Oh, oh, stealing my clothes and the towel from the babies. No, not the babies. <laughs> from the places a shower room and forcing me to chase you is not showing affection. I've only done that once. No, you've done it eleven times, and it wasn't funny or kawaii even once. You know what I'm gonna do? Uh, I'm just gonna also he's, keep that. He's going to do it. I'm just he's keep... going to do it. Oh. Why? But you can see already. Because it's faster. It's not even that. It's like super not the word. That's what I'm saying. Actually, I don't know what it is from mixer to that, but like it's slow. That is like if you type directly in the end bit, it's like half a second. Yeah, but that's half a second. Like it, I think it's actually slower if you type it, because it has to go half a second and then it has to do this. So I'm just gonna have both on. Fair enough. No, you've died already. Um, I'd beg to differ on the kawaii part. See, even the American over there thinks it would be funny. No, he said kawaii, which means his mind is thinking something rather dirty. 
Guilty as charged, Comrade Commissar. Ha <laughs> ha! Very funny. If you sat your commander in the pe Korean People's Army, you would be shot. She's always so sarcastic. Screen's frozen again. Oof, it is, yeah. yeah. I'm saving. <laughs> so glad there's nine pages of saves. Bless. Alright, let's just go back here. He doesn't like being all tab, so I'm just gonna try not to do it. Start it up again. It's all these technical difficulties, you know. What, even my hero isn't bad enough to get me shot? I suggest you try it while we're out today and see where it oh, gets shit. you. Oh shit, and uh -oh. I did all tab anyway. Oh no. Uh, just so oh no. Just no, we canceled Jackbox today. Because two people said they didn't want to play Jackbox. Yeah. Okay, good. It's still good. Because nobody wanted to play, so we canceled it. That's not what happened. Yes, it was. Anyway. I'll go get the dressed while I call the driver. Ma'am, yes, ma'am. Well, time to take a quick shower and get dressed so that I can see what this big surprise is all about. So, quid? No, uh, it's okay. You can say it. I hope you're in the thick of it. No, not that. I mean, like, no, so quid. We're coming up to a screen. If so, you... quid? I don't think so. I think it's probably after the third date, though, now that I think about it. Nobody. Whole people said no. Two whole people said no. That was enough, because I didn't see any yeses. I only saw noes. So, you know, that's a majority to me. Uh, I'm, then I'm both curious and scared at the same time. <laughs> yeah, we did pass the butthole. Wait, are there two buttholes, or only, is there only one butthole? Yeah, that's... Uh... How many buttholes are there? Showered and... Clothes? Check. Wallet? Check. Cell phone? <laughs> Damn it. I'm as ready as I'll ever be then. Good me. Two Americans take so long to get ready. What are you talking about? I was gone all of 10 minutes. Tops, including shower. Okay, only one butthole. Okay, good. And you've been... Fuck. And you'd be... Have been whipped five times for being five minutes over the limit. You mean to tell me you got ready in five minutes? That's surprising, considering the state of your room. I'd imagine it'd take you at least that long to even find your shoes. Why is that? Don't the rest of us get ready in five minutes? Hell no, they don't. I mean, shit, my sister takes 30 minutes just to put on her makeup, let alone pick up what to wear. Of course, then again, you have an advantage in that you already know to wear your uniform. He does have a point. On days off, it does take me an extra couple of minutes to pick between the three acceptable off-duty blouses I own. Oh yeah, they're pretty annoying that way. But still, five minutes? That doesn't seem... I stop wasting your time, and the driver is waiting. Oh. Oh, fuck. She got close real quick. Yeah, she did. And with that, Yugi girl grasps my hand full force and drags me out the front door. She wants to get close to me. I've seen her butthole, you know? I've seen it in passing, I guess. What is it with these girls dragging me by the hand? Though I guess it beats her barking orders at me. Oh, stop at dragging your toes! A one, a two, a one, a two! It's like she can read my mind. Scary, I tell you. Once outside, I can see the car waiting. The driver is watching our approach, and I'm pretty sure he's snickering at Yu-Gi-Oh, dragging me around like an overstuffed rucksack. I can walk on my own, you know? Oh, perhaps, but you don't seem capable of doing it in a timely manner. Sometimes it's just not worth arguing with yu gi -Girl. I give her the raised eyebrow salute before hopping off into the <laughs> familiar backseat of the car. To Pablo, driver. Good old Pablo. 
The driver grunts in response as he starts the engine up. Random Mexican 4-4! Four, four. Welcome to the experience. Nice. You know, it won't kill you to say please to the poor guy. He does have to drive us to our destination and then sit around in the car until we get back. Oh, I'm not necessarily a glorious leader might call for him in the between. Anyways, here's a subordinate. It is not necessary to show courtesy to a subordinate. They might start expecting it or something if you start doing that. You do realize you're not showing courtesy to the man who could literally drive us off a cliff or something, right? <laughs> oh, for Peach's sake. It, if he'll make you happy, I'll thank him. Thanks for driving us, comrade. And for my effort, his response is the same damn grunt he gave before. He said the thanks. Can we talk about the something else now? Sure, how about telling, about, uh, telling me what Pueblo is, because I'm pretty sure it's not anything like the city in Colorado. Uh, Pueblo is a part museum, is part of a museum in Pyongyang, a museum of greatness. What? <laughs> of the greatest importance to our national part and our history. <laughs> Master the English language. Yes, master. I am the master! Sounds interesting, but why in the world would part of it be called Pueblo? That's a Spanish name and the name of an Indian tribe in the US. Call me crazy, but I don't think your relatively sparse international ties include Spain or Indians. Oh, you weren't crazy. We didn't name it ourselves. Well, if you didn't name it, then who did? I'm, sh I'm pretty sure this is like a real thing that they're about to teach us. I don't know the name of the individual who named it, but I'm relatively certain it was a member of your government. I don't get it. Why would a we're member of some history now. our government name some part of a museum for Korea? He didn't name it for us. We got it named the way it was. If you can't piece it together from that, we'll understand in about 10 minutes as we're not far from our destination. Got pieces together, named by someone in American government, and it came to Korea named that way. That indicates we named it for ourselves and not for Korea's sake. Pueblo, Pueblo, oh fuck me, I think I know what this might be and I don't like it. This museum we're going to, it wouldn't happen to be related to military operations, would it? <laughs> oh, why yes, you seem to be making progress. Now we're going to the Pyongyang Victories War Museum. There's really only one branch of the United States military that places such pomp and circumstance on naming individual vessels. You're taking me to see a Navy ship, the USS Pueblo to be precise. Oh, maybe you aren't as dumb as I thought. You're precisely correct. Alright, Uber, get ready. That's probably going to be a picture. Oh, I hope so. Up. The USS Pueblo served as a symbol of one of our country's greatest victories over capitalist oppression. Well, maybe I can let some of my semen buddies know how it's faring in captivity. Oh, stop whining! The only reason we haven't scrapped it is because it's still commissioned. Wait, so the Navy still hasn't decommissioned the ship? I mean, if this was some recent incident, I'd have heard about it. This ship must be pretty old, why bother keeping a commission on it? I do not know why. At some point, there was discussion of returning the ship to your country, but those talks fell through. Good luck trying to give it back when it's been turned into a museum. Who says I want our country to give it back? Suddenly, I'm really not looking forward to this excursion. Anyway, I guess I'll get to see your country side of the event. The two side, yes. The rest of the short car ride is completed in silence. Though, I'd say it was only comfortable sounds for Yuki girl. I mean, yeah. The Marine Corps had a little bit of inter-service rivalry with the Navy, but in the end, they're still brothers in arms, our family. The pervy uncle no, no one talks about but still gets invited to Thanksgiving, member of the family to be sure, but still family. So I'm just a bit pissed that one of their ships is being floated in some dumpy North Korean harbor as a tourist trap. Possibly a literal trap at that, this isn't going to be an easy uh, excursion. As I'm trying to figure out my marching orders for this date, whoops, my thoughts are scattered, and suddenly I'm yanked from the car. Yeah, you're making it all to the, all fuck, I fucked it up. The uh, master. Of you're the making English it language. to all the northern countries. There we go. Yeah. North Korea, 
the United States. That's all I got. That <laughs> <laughs> was like... Another dreaming about my sister. What here? You sure I wasn't daydreaming about you? That made her blush good. Well, why did you go and say something about her like that? Of course you're dreaming of dong! All guys Jesus. do that. They... They never even look at me. You wouldn't have to be jealous of John, would you? Uh, of course not. I, I don't even care about... As fun as this is, I do feel a little bad for you, girl. I should try and cheer her up some. It's obvious she has trouble connecting with people. Relax, Yuki girl. I wasn't daydreaming of John, or even you. Believe it or not, guys do think of other things than girls from time to time. Like... Overwatch. <laughs> no, no, no. Is In that your that case, true? is... Does that girl have Overwatch? Yeah, but it's, you mean it's like Overwatch? <laughs> <laughs> Gotta play that Overwatch, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta carry on those freaking E-cards or whatever. <laughs> That's such a good idea. Just bring them to BlizzCon. I gotta, like, really <laughs> You're gonna bring it to BlizzCon? The worst possible audience for this? Because well, they probably have But they already have Overwatch, so you can play. <laughs> so you, we have to go to, like, the WoW section or something. Because, like, if we're, in, if we're in the Overwatch arena, people probably no, already No, but that's what I'm Overwatch. saying. If, like, I could bring them and be like, yo, add me on Overwatch. Let's fucking oh, the, game. Oh, your B-net. Yeah, let's group. That's a good hey, idea. Hey, girl, give me your B-net. Yeah. <laughs> it's that. So, so, then I'll hand her a card. You know, we're like... <laughs> Mike Croon <Crude> here. <laughs> it's like a gun. Bam! Like that. I don't think you want to do that in the United States. No, no, but it's like, you know, you don't make the bang sound effect, but it's like, bam. Silence. Like, but you're holding, like, the car like that. Right? Oh, yeah. So Get, are you going to do it, like, <laughs> Gambit style, where you just, like, shoot it into their neck? I could, yeah. Just, bam! Just decapitates it. That'd be unfortunate. <laughs> if they have Overwatch. I'd probably get banned from that. From <laughs> they will, not that. you. No, see, the way you get banned is if you, uh... <laughs> Ask them if this is an out of season April Fool's joke. Yeah, that's funny. That's pretty funny. Um, With their bean net on it. Bean net. Bean it! <laughs> <laughs> hey girl, what's your bean net tag? Yeah. <laughs> fuck this. That's your new gen uh, pickup line. Holy fuck. Of course, sometimes I think about food too. Fair enough. Actually, I mostly think about food. I hate you. I don't believe you. You're too kawaii to truly hate anyone. So are we going to the museum or directly to the ship? I promised you the Pablo. So we'll go there first. Oh, fuck. Okay, picture time. Uh, Uber, can I get a IRL photo, please? She grabs my hand and starts leading towards the harbor off of the Botong River. That wrecks! 420. <laughs> That's it's good. Thing. I like. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> oh, cause. <laughs> That's so funny. It's actually ripping. There's it, no dude. escaping any of these characters, for some reason. It's <laughs> giving it, giving her the good rip. Rips. Sure enough, there's an old navy ship moored there. However, it doesn't look like much of a combat vessel. Even a marine like myself can tell if the ship lacks any modern equipment. And seems to be uh, only be armed with two You know, he called himself a marine, so wouldn't he be on the ship? Huh? He called himself a marine. Yeah. So wouldn't he be used to being on ships? Um, well, sometimes. It's not, that's not, like, common. Or not as common, I guess. Like The, the Marines the, the, are a Navy contingent, the, not a uh, land-based one. Huh? No, no, yeah, but they, they still operate on ground as well. Yeah, but the, you should but you like, think that they'd be on ships, though. They deploy from ships, do they not? Yeah, first of all, this is an old fucking-ass yeah. ship. And no, the but, Navy would be more familiar. Yeah, yeah, but he was like... He's, he's said multiple times that like, he's in the Army, not the Navy. But now he's saying, like, he's Wait, a did he say that he was in the Army, not... No, because the army is separate from the marines, and marines is also separate from the navy. Oh, there it is. Oh, there we go. Oh, wow. It is like an exact one-to-one -one picture. That's great. Nice. 
Yeah, like, it's not, like, they're, they're like, more specialized in that they basically do what the situation... Uh, yeah, but they're, like, technically Navy, are they not? This guy's... Did somebody being... look this up? No, I, 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 I know this! this like, this the thing is, like... Alright, what are we looking it up? Go to Wikipedia, Marine. Ah! Naval Infantry. Yeah, look! So the Navy! They're on fucking ground! Yeah, but they're the Navy! No, so no, right. no, no, the Navy is a separate branch of the, like, a completely separate yeah, branch I know of, that. of the military. I know that. So is the Air Force. Yeah, yeah. they're not the same thing. I'm not, I'm not saying they're the same thing. He said that they were the same thing. No, no, but what are you actually saying? You're saying that he should be very familiar with the ship because he's a Marine? Yes. I'm saying that it's possible that he is familiar, but it's not a required thing because they operate wherever the hell Hell, they need to operate. It's yeah. not just because, like, the word marine doesn't mean like they are naval infantry. Yeah, they're still but, infantry. Yeah, but naval. So you think that they oh deploy from God. a ship? No. They don't jump no. out of planes, do they? <laughs> they jump out of planes. I don't believe that. <laughs> they jump out of planes. But do the planes come off of ships, aircraft carriers? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. <laughs> so like, I want to right, die. <laughs> right? I want to die. But like the origin, okay, the explain, origin though. is the ship. No, not necessarily. That's my point. Is that, is that just because they're called marines doesn't mean they are like so they're the air force. ship based. I think they're ship based. Though. And min wise, I think they. Oh yeah, there you go. It falls under the administration. So the thing is like, they, it doesn't mean they have to start from a ship. <laughs> <laughs> that is what I'm saying. They can come from. Literally anywhere else, but it doesn't mean. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> What's a good example? I transport you in a car every week. Do you? Yes. Are you extremely familiar with the inner makings of a car? I'm pretty familiar with your car, yes. No, like, if, if, if it broke, could you fix it? Oh, I mean, no. Then what the, what the hell? <laughs> but, if you're a mechanic, would somebody assume that you knew how yeah. to fix a yeah, car? Yeah, the army, you know, a ground-based branch of the military, it must, they must be on ground. Yeah. If they see water, they're like, fuck, we better walk around that. <laughs> the army must start on land for it to count. Yeah. <laughs> they can't, they can't be flown from, by like, fucking, or they can't even get into vehicles, really, if you think about it. <laughs> no, no, they can, they can go on ground, but like, I was saying that Seals like, must like, deploy from an iceberg. <laughs> but like, no, <laughs> But does, like, do ships not have a contingency of marines? <laughs> no, the navy bans the fucking ships. And Is the marines can't be thing? on a ship, depending on what they're trying to do. You know? Like, if they need a fucking ship to get to where they need to operate... Yeah. Then they can, they can, have, they can be on a or ship. Or, they could just deploy the ship. They can't move on the sea tiles. Which... <laughs> it's like sin. <laughs> if you were born on land, you could never be in the <laughs> Air Force. No! No! It makes sense to me! You guys are all wrong! You guys are all thinking about this the logic. wrong way. So. Like, uh, do you, okay, in your head, do you think that Marines are actually at the controls of the ship? No. No, those are the sailors. What? Are they, are they in a fucking, like, little, like, no, four by Marines... four room where they just stand there? No. And then, I mean, like, they do have the, a al the alarm goes <laughs> off and they're like, we need Marines for this! I mean, yeah, honestly, yeah. Oh, Is that not how it works? That's not how, that's not, that's not how it works. Like, no, no, it makes sense. They're not sailors. They're infantrymen, right? They're like right? a fucking mini reserve right on there. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. Oh that's, my God. Dude, do ships not have a reserve of marines? Is that not a thing? No. Are you sure that's not a thing? Yes, I'm, I'm sure that's not a thing. Do you really just stand there until like something happens? What yeah. if nothing happens? They're just gonna stand there for their entire fucking. That's right. Said yes. This, I, I don't know what the. I don't know how to. I don't know how to do this. They're the marine box. Yeah, the, yeah, the marine box. <laughs> Every ship has a marine box. I don't understand because in Halo they have their own contingencies per per ship. <laughs> so what's the deal there? They're different, first of all, because they're in fucking space. <laughs> but they're still the Navy. <laughs> yeah, no, no. And the they're thing, still Marines. The thing is, like, like the ship docking onto something, okay, or getting on the land versus, a, like, a spaceship, 
not being in space, I think those are very different things. So you would have more things or contingencies on a spaceship yeah. because you expect them to be out longer. Wouldn't that make sense just from a logic point of view? Also, it's Halo. I know, but I mean, like, in other sci-fi stuff, too. <laughs> yeah, but they're all fucking, like, it's space always the navy. It's always the Navy, and it's always Marines, because it's... It, make, it makes... Wait, so, so the Marines in Halo technically shouldn't have been allowed to land. Is that what you're saying? No, they had to land, but they were deployed by the Pillar of Autumn. Because no. the Pillar of Autumn, like, no, no. they were assigned to that ship. <laughs> oh, I, see, I see where your misconceptions from. You're literally taking... Halo logic. Yeah, I thought it's. And the Marines can life. operate outside the ship in Halo. Yes, too, they can. can. They can, but they are the contingency of said ship. Yeah, but they can exist outside of a contingency capacity. Yes, as well. I, yes, they absolutely can. But, but the, what the, was there a box that they all? But stayed? in Halo, they all come from ships. Because everybody came from ships. Yeah, that's fucking insane. Halo. Yeah, it's, it's a contingency. It's like a ship. base. Yeah. But that's not true, though, because they have the Marines, and then they have the actual army, though. Yeah. Yeah. Th th that's fine. So, like, they're, they are, they're, they're separate, though. You can have separate branches and not have people be confined to, like, wherever you think they logically have to come from. <laughs> like, your Air Force, you better fucking show up in a plane or you're done. Like, that. I mean, I, okay. Oh All right. So maybe I shouldn't have based it off of my Halo board. You know? And I feel like you don't even know it's, it's the like... way it works in Halo. No, I do well. know how it works in Halo, and I was trying to apply it to real life, but apparently real life doesn't work that way. It doesn't, because we're so in that's dumb, dude. We're not in fucking space. Well, we should be in fucking space. <laughs> when are the Space Corps coming out, dude? When the fuck is the Space Corp becoming reality? Master Chief is in the Navy. Yes, Master Chief is a naval officer. Yeah, you can tell because of his, his fucking rank. Yeah, it Master says Chief. Petty yeah. officer, yeah, I know. No, no, I know you don't. Just people, okay, some people, yeah. some people All right. answered incorrectly. Okay, let's do okay. this. I Jesus think, Christ. Right. Let's just, okay. <laughs> the fucking Marine <laughs> box. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, <laughs> the barracks. <laughs> Makes sense. It makes perfect sense to me. Like, I don't know how it does <laughs> It's already like super cramped on a fucking ship, and you want like another box with, with a bunch of men in it. I mean, have you seen those ships? They're fucking like ten kilometers long, dude. Yeah, but I mean, like they use they use their space very well. They do. Those which ships. Is true. Okay, let's just continue. Right, let's just yeah, right, fuck. Browning fifty caliber machine guns. Sure. Yeah, no Master Chief. Yeah, dude. Master Chief is like an actual or like Master Chief Petty Officer is an actual rank. Impressive feat, capturing a navy ship. <laughs> Where's your marine box? I would love to see. Oh, I suppose that capturing a combat ship from the second the best of navy in the world is sort of an accomplishment. Hate the rain on your poop deck, but that's not a combat ship. And just how would you know, Mr. Army Ranger boy? First, I am not a ranger. And I'm not even in the army. So there we go, he is a marine. In the navy. He's a marine. Right, maybe he's gonna explain it. To he's us. a marine. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna let him explain. He's it. not in the navy. <laughs> he's not in the navy. Secondly, look at some of those the decks. They're too low. Get in, uh, get into close combat, and the ship could be boarded easily. And the weaponry appears defensive at best. Oh well then, if it's not for combat, what order is the ship I use that for? I can't say for certain, but giving a, a, a guess, I say it started out as a supply or cargo ship. The low decks would serve well for tossing stuff on and off. That's ridiculous. Why would the su supply ship be stationed anywhere near Korean waters? I don't know. When was it captured? In January of 1968. Now it makes sense. That's close to the Vietnam War era. A ship like this would be adequate for reconnaissance missions. So it was meant to be a spy ship after all. Damn, I had hoped that was just a rumor. Afraid not, if it was caught in the Pacific around Japan or Korea in 1968, it was likely attempting to gain info from radio frequencies. It wasn't Japan. The American ship clearly violated Korean waters. You'll see when we get to the gallery. For long, we're taken on board the Pueblo. While entering, I have to admit that they've kept the boat in pretty decent shape. 
They didn't repair any of the damage from the gunfire, but the outside is clean and the deck lo- appears okay. Okay, so when Trump makes his Space Force, will they be Marines? Well, who's in charge in the air, or in, in space? Is it is it the, the Navy? Well, in real life, there isn't one. <laughs> no, I mean, like, <laughs> the, nobody's nobody has, like, jurisdiction up there, but, like... I wonder what uh, branch would get it. It would be it would be Navy, right? Actually, they could just create a new branch. They could. That's what I think he's actually doing. I'd be like, okay with them making it the I Navy. I think he's actually creating the Space Corps, which is a new Space branch. Space Ice. Which is the new branch of the military. So they'll have the land. Because it won't be... They'll have the Air it, Force. Yeah, like, they, it would either be... Space Force is going to be... Oh, actually, you're is probably it actually, right. Would it be the Air Force, It though? would be the Air Force, because they send shit up there anyway. They already I have mean, that's a good point. And that's how there, it works actually. in Stargate as well. It would be the Air Force. I think you're right. I was thinking Navy because... I was thinking Halo because of yeah. some asshole over But it, it would be the Air Force in real yeah. life. Or... Because they already... They already have... Like, the already Air Force already shit, does yeah. a lot of stuff up there. That's a, that's a good point. No. I don't know. I don't... I think it's the Air Force. It would be... It would be Air Force. Space is just big air. <laughs> like in like in, in Stargate, right? Nerd, it's it's the Air Force that run. And they run fucking spaceships and stuff. Yeah, it would be the Air Force, I think. Um but in like but Trump might make like an actual space like arm of the fucking military, which I think he's doing. Where right, right they're not allowed to operate anywhere else but in space. Yeah. It would just be <laughs> the force. It could be the force. Okay, all right. Let's let's continue. I guess it could have been worse. Seems seems you've kept the ship in decent shape. Of course we did. It wouldn't be much of a museum if it was in a bad condition. But yeah, I didn't really watch Continuum though, so I don't really count that as canon. And she and drove... plus you said alternate timeline, so yeah. fuck that shit. Dude. It is alternate. As she drills on a bit about how the utmost care was taken by the Korean Navy to keep the ship in tip-top shape. I head over the, uh, the starboard side, which faces the water. I okay, mean, the, no one's fighting in space yet. The thing about fighting in space is it's not going to look anywhere near as exciting as, it's like, not, inside. It was going to be just, all. like, it's you can't even, like, see the ships it's in the same frame, shitty. basically. Yeah, no, yeah, you're not going to be able to see it's ships. It's actually going to be kind of, like, closer to, to like, uh, naval battles. Where it's, it's just, just like, like people are yeah, so far away from look, each other. Yeah. And you're like, man, I hope this hits. <laughs> like, it's so far that you just Honestly, have, you yeah. like fight so far away from each other, right? I mean, yeah, I know that. Looking over, it gives a stark contrast to the clean facade when it gets entering the ship. The starboard side is resting over and shows no signs of repair in ages. Not even a coat of paint to try and hide the contempt the Koreans feel for the vessel. Bastards. Hey, Yuki girl, your navy does know that there are two sides to a ship, right? Oh, of course they do. Even I know that. Port and starboard. What about it? Your port side looks fine, but it doesn't look like you touched the starboard side since you acquired the ship. No, no one ever looks over there anyway. Leave it to you to be the person to walk over and check the side that no one cares about. Well, I came over here because that's where the marine that's boxes where the rest are. Of the, sh- <laughs> yeah, the ship is. Come on now, you said this was a symbol of one of your country's greatest victories. Could you put a little effort into preserving it if it's so damn important? Nope, can't be bothered. Front looks good, inside is fine. Who cares about the backside? You've just offended ass men everywhere. Whatever. Are you coming back to check the inside or what? There's art in photos as well as some of the materials the crew had left behind. Since most of the captured material has been declassified now, the workers' party has placed the original documents back in the codeum. Great. It would be kind of cool to see what the crew was trying to learn. Yugi girl wastes no time in grabbing my hand and dragging me into the inner portions of the ship. Oh, cool. All right, Uber. Can I get an image? Please? Wow, this just looks. Look at this. It's just a picture. Yeah, it is. It's just a picture. Uber, uh, hook me up, please. That's your job. Your job is image man. <laughs> On the walls. So tired. Hang mostly paintings and a couple of pictures. 
each depicting a part of Korea's narrative of the events in 1968. Even just a cursory glance shows that their version of the story is dubious at best. Actually, that's probably doing the word dubious a disservice, since dubious implies a very small chance that there's truth being told. Most of what I see is a load of bullshit. Hey, Yugi girl, do you really think the American ship situa uh, situated itself right there, just offshore of the mainland, like this painting depicts? Of course! You brave the Americans think you can steal right in front of people. Well, I will never show you how we feel about spies in two Korea! Yeah, I'm sorry. We may be brave, but we aren't idiots. Why is the captain of the crew <laughs> wearing just his silkies? Hell yeah, dude! And a white beater while holding a half-empty bottle of grand-style whiskey. That's how I would captain my fucking ship. Captain Morgan, right? right Hell before you yeah, fall. Captain Morgan it! Right before <laughs> right you before I slip on paper. <laughs> Well, maybe that part isn't too far, uh, too off the mark if Gunny is any example. Oh, fucking Gunny. But seriously, the painting over here depicts the crew playing shuffleboard. Hell yeah, dude. And if this ship was actually invading your coastline, wouldn't they have burned all the documents if they thought there was a chance of being captured? How should I know? If this is your country's idea of the world's second best navy, you aren't holding much of a standard for the rest of the world. Damn, he's going hard. <laughs> Was Russia's navy a bunch of vodka drinking bears and rowboats? That would be scary, dude. That would be. She doesn't say anything as we walk over to where the very few photos are. In one is what looks like a bunch of Korean guys having fun playing poker. In another is what appears to be the command crew of the Pueblo in a group shot. Hey, Yugi girl. This photo here appears to be a bunch of Koreans playing card games. What does that have to do with anything? Oh, <coughs> the ones in the middle are the Americans that were on that ship when we captured it. This photo shows them having a good time with our countrymen, and how well they were treated in captivity as negotiations ensured. Yeah, not seeing it. I don't see any Americans in this picture at all. I mean, yeah, we're a pretty big melting pot of different ethnicities, but there's no way we had that many Asian crew members back then. Hell, I don't even see any black guys in this photo. I mean, not to be silly, but there's no way these are the actual crew members. Clearly you aren't looking hard enough. The six in the middle are absolutely American. I don't think we're gonna agree on this. There's nothing to agree to. Facts are facts, and the picture says a hundred words. We really need to work on your slang. Dropping the subject of why Korea thought it could pass off their Navy crew as ours, I turned to the group photo. I bet that's the actual photo. Damn. A few of them sitting as a group, like part of an interview or something. These guys actually look like an American crew, so this must be a propaganda photo. Looking closer, I noticed something about the crew members. Something that they're doing that changes my opinion on at least. They're all scene. given the finger. <laughs> I noticed that. Mm -hmm. Those glorious <laughs> bastards. The absolute man man. <laughs> Way to go, boys! This is Marine salutes you. Absolute madman. See, I noticed that right away. Oh, what are you rambling on about? Look at the sailors in this photo. See how they all station their hands so that their middle fingers are extended well, not towards the camera? Well, the guy in the background. His is hidden up. I guess. That's pure gold. Oh, you mean the Hawaiian good luck sign? Yep. Good luck. Yes, the slayers said that they were treated so well that they wanted to extend well wishes to our Navy members. That's funny. After all, they knew what they did was wrong, but it wasn't their fault. Orders are orders, right? Better and better, it appears that the Koreans, at least at the time, had no idea the sailors were telling them to fuck off in secret. And even if they found out, they're still telling new generations of military members that the Americans lied to prevent embarrassment. I'm tempted to crush this misconception, but then playing along with it might be entertaining as well. So quid! I don't think it matters, to be honest. So quid? So we're gonna have a poll. So quid. Press one! Actually, let's make a save. And. I don't know if I can make a save here. Yes, I can. Let's make a save, and we'll finish this next week. How about that for timing? Oh yeah, seven Perfect minutes left, timing. actually. Just 
choices don't matter. That's just like real life. Anyway, webcam me up and I'll do our outro. People started picking. Ah, uh, it's too late. You guys have to pick. We'll actually week. put up a real poll for next week because this new bot can do polls. Oh really? Can you put a poll right now for something? No, because I've already closed down everything. <gasps> what? Come on! What if you could do like a straw poll? If it's not like during the stream. Can someone start a straw poll? <laughs> Alright! Thanks for t I can't see myself. Can somebody start a straw poll and, and put two options? One is for us to keep testing this thing. Or to not. Thanks for tuning in to another exciting episode of the MyCast Experience. I've been your host, Kushkin Kroon, a.k.a. Mike. With me, we had special guest, Westside Wola, a.k.a. Westy, a.k.a. Wiley. Next week, we'll be back with more Stay Stay DP, okay? And maybe, if the people want it, we'll play Jackbox, because I have some codes to give away. Those are overly... Well, or just come up with whatever options you guys think make sense. Like, what do you guys want to do? Um, yeah, okay, that's it. Or maybe, oh, maybe not. I don't know. I, we can have that poll at a different time. We can just add, oh, hold on. Go, let's go. Okay, cool. Um, it's so slow. Okay. So, all right, multiple polls are being hmm, posted. I don't know which one to vote in, so I'm not It's okay, voting. we can just do it at a different time. Uh, yeah, okay, and, uh, I will be playing Resident Evil 2 Remake tomorrow, so tomorrow make sure to tune Tomorrow afternoon? So generous! Two streams! Unbelievable, <laughs> the generosity on so this stream. Large. Jesus Christ. Uh, so I will, I will post a time, probably tomorrow or tonight, and, yeah, I look forward to seeing you guys there. It's gonna be, I'm pretty excited. But I'm going to need people to show up because I can't do this by myself. I'm going to be too scared to do this. Um, that's it. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you guys. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, but we'll see you guys next week. Have a great weekend. Goodbye. Thank you.